sorry I just gave you sorry about that. I was like talking to myself right there for a second. Welcome to the channel, my friends. Thank you for hanging out. I was saying, hold on one second. Let me turn down that stream that I'm watching. I was watching uh, Craig. He's playing some Red Dead Redemption, actually. Okay, let's get back to this little stream. Excellent. Okay, let me jump back to the game real quick so that the screen goes back to normal. All right, escapees, thank you for hanging out tonight. Let me turn down my own cast before it uh, blows up on me over here. All right, there we go. Quiet that down. What up, Blue? We got that first type for, for the beloved. Oops, I put the wrong one, but we could do that one too, Blue. I just hyped it up for you. There. Throw down that first type for Blue Wolf. How are you doing, Wolf? You made it to hump day? Yes. Almost to that weekend. Almost. A little bit longer, you guys. Two more days. All right. Well, we defeated the Crystal Sage last night on the last cast. And uh, let's see what unfolds ahead. At least that's what I typed in right here for Twitter. We are live now at twitch.tv slash soul underscore escape, capital S-U-L underscore 3SC4P3. All right, you guys. I'm going to post it out to the beautiful Twitter. Posting it out to Facebook. I was prepared today. I had it all typed out. Posting it out here on Twitch. Guys, feel free to share and show the love on those feeds down there. That'd be amazing, guys. We need a little bit of help on that. I do, I do. We need some help, escapees. All right, excellent, excellent. The Craig channel is turned down. There's this stream, there we are. <laughs> Phaedra coming in with that close second. She's like, damn it, Blue, I wanted to be first. Oh, just got off work, Blue. Nice. How did that go? Was it okay day? I know, man. I've been having some, uh, they've been okay days, but kind of rough, to be honest. I don't know if uh, the kids are a little bit hyper. Maybe it was from the fair and stuff, all that candy. Xbox was slow. What up, Steel? What was the Xbox being slow? No. No. <laughs> Blue's first for once. I know, right? Blue's never first. No. Jesse, how are you doing? Guys, welcome to the channel. We've got a lot of escapees right off the bat. Thank you. Thanks for coming in. How was your hump day, you guys? Wednesday hype. Yay. Okay, so I'll admit I was playing this a little bit before we jumped on stream. And uh, I may have made some mistakes. No, not mistakes, but um, I'll be honest, you guys. We... Okay, well, I, I guess I, I can't include the cast on this because you guys didn't tell me to do it. Well... There are a couple of escapees that suggested, but um, I took those, remember how we leveled up for free, quote unquote free, um, yesterday by talking to that character, Yol, and uh, well, he let us level up for free a couple of times, but when I saved the game, I realized that my poor character, the beautiful Gia, even though she wasn't that gorgeous or anything, uh, she, uh, gosh, she looked like a zombie, so I guess... We'll see what she looks like right now. But yes, I was playing a little bit ago, and I just noticed that. I'm like, why? So of course I did a quick Google search. I was like, why do I look like that? And uh, it says it's because I've been taking those free levels. I knew there was a catch, but we have to finish that quest line in order to get rid of it or something to do with that. I tried not to go too deep into it, but all right, you guys. I know, free, never free, right, Blue? It's never free. Never, you guys. Unless it is, that is. Okay, let's go ahead, we'll start it on up. Oh, that is loud. All right. So I did just log out a couple of minutes ago. I made it to, yesterday I believe we stopped at about level, what level were we, guys? Level 52? Level 52 or 51? But anyways, right now we're at level 53. I took another free level off the cast and I leveled up uh, once more just by myself with those 8,000 levels that we got from the, or excuse me, 8,000 souls that we got from the Crystal Sage. I just kind of fought a couple of enemies a few minutes ago. All right, so it's logging me in right now. Fingers crossed that it actually works. Let's get the stream started officially. Oh, we failed to log in. I'm gonna try again. If you keep spamming it, eventually somebody, I guess, leaves the server. <laughs> Guys, oh, the stream is starting in. Five, four, three, two. Welcome to the Soul Stream. Thank you for hanging out on this lovely Wednesday edition of the cast. Oh, I got the wrong one. Sorry, sorry, escapees. Wednesday edition of the cast. I do appreciate it. And once again, I do hope you had a good day, you guys. 
And if not, hopefully it was at least, fingers crossed, an okay day. I know there's been a lot of tragedy going around, a lot of loss, a lot of death. And uh, it's been overall kind of kind of a sad year, too, that kind of lingered from 2016. Remember, everybody was like, oh, this is a sad year. Snapped a quick pick roll real fast, my friends. There. I didn't take it right now. I took it about five minutes ago. We just had it sitting there. Oh, no. What happened, Blue? He almost got into a fight with the homeless guy. Blue, that poor man already doesn't have a home. That's rude, Blue. No, just kidding. No, sometimes they... Okay, I'll be honest. Um, when we were in California and stuff, there were a couple of homeless people that were really like, you know, they're kind of like really start to nag at you. Like, oh, I know you got money. You ain't from here. You know, I know you're traveling. You got a couple dollars to spare. I'm like, whoa, man. <laughs> I do, but these are for, you know, my trip home. <laughs> dollars for my trip home man I'm just trying to log in right now escapees I guess we could play offline but I haven't played offline I don't know if it'll affect anything I want in on the server silly mugs how are you doing welcome to the channel you guys okay let's no 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 if I cancel it there we go Woo, finally Whoosh. I was like what four tries I think that's harder than fighting a boss right there just logging in Okay, so I'll show you my character's face once we uh, get into the game here. Just promise not to scream too loud. It's pretty gross. The homeless guy. Oh, okay. Oh, no, I would have kicked his butt too then, Blue. Now you were well within your reason. He says the homeless guy almost attacked a girl on a bike. Dude, that's crazy. He must have been on some of that bath salts. Some of those bath salts. Okay, look at my face. No. Oh. More hideous than usual. Gosh, granted, this isn't my good looking character. I have a character named Xena, which uh, I made her off the cast, so I was able to focus in really, you know, on her fine feature details. So she's a better looking character than this one, but jeez, I didn't know. I didn't know. I knew it. I knew it yesterday, though. Look, see? Ugh. Excuse me. But I knew it yesterday, taking those levels, I knew there was going to be some kind of crazy repercussion. Ugh. Jeez. That poor girl. Look what happened to her beautiful face. Ugh. No, I feel you, Blue. That is completely awful. <laughs> Homeless guys and their bikes. Their rusty old bikes, their rusty old tires. Oh, Pedro, I can't wait to see your face. Ugh. <laughs> Okay, well anyways, I <laughs> I saved the game a couple of minutes ago and that's what I saw. I was like, oh, gross. And then I had to look too. I was like, oh, her face really is like that. And just to make sure, I saved at the bonfire like twice to see if it would go away. But no, apparently we're hollowed now. And I'm not too sure what that means. I, I think it means that we don't have our own soul anymore or something like that. But um, damn that Yol. He didn't say there would be any like facial repercussions. That's the main reason, one of the main reasons, you guys, that I don't want to be a vampire in Oblivion or Skyrim or any of the Elder Scrolls games is because it makes you look a little bit like this. Your eyes get red, your skin gets all wrinkly and old as a vampire, and uh, oh, you're just a very unattractive character after that. It's super powerful, but jeez, it's like you got to find a mask that actually closes. Now I'm going to have to change my helmet for a couple... Yeah, you know what? That's right. Let's change our helmet for a couple of streams now. <laughs> No, we'll stay like this, you guys. I won't be rude. So I'm about 2,000 levels away from leveling up, so let's just go back real quick. I'm gonna travel. Let's travel back to the Road of Sacrifices, where it was disgusting birds there. <laughs> she is terrible looking, you guys. She is awful looking. Yeah, no, it, it is good. It's good that you took him out, Blue. I was gonna say took her out. <laughs> took out the girl on the bike, no! It's good that you took the homeless dude out, you know? Did you have to, like... Well, see, you said you almost got into a fight, so I'm guessing no physical altercation had to occur. That's always a good thing. For sure, for sure. Oh, yes, there is a card that I've been meaning to flash. It's the command card. I do have it, but I haven't been showing it recently. Guys, this is, this is a list right here of all the commands that are available. To any of the escapees, even if you're not following, I think you can still hit any of those commands right there, just to check various items. There we go. <laughs> just flash that. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to incorporate that card a bit more. I've had it forever, you guys. 
Same with the new follower hype card. I've had this card forever too. It's just it took we used to use it, but uh, nowadays, especially when we started playing that Fallout, we had those, geez, like 30 follows a night. Um, we'd be like, oh god, well here, new follower, new follower. So we had to get rid of that. Blue, thank you for the host. I was watching a little bit of Craigasm myself, and Summit, actually. They were playing uh, Star Wars 2 beta. I'm like, what? Star Wars Battlefront 2, I should say. Verify. And yes, I was playing this also. I was, I was. Hey Blue, how is your uh, Wednesday going? Almost said Monday, uh oh. That would have been not smart. Like remember that Thursday where I was like, happy Friday you guys, it's almost Saturday. Everybody's like, soul, it's uh, Thursday right now. <laughs> Oops. Well, you can see where my brain was at while celebrating the weekend. Blue said no, he goes up to the girl he's, and he asks for something. She said no, the light turns green, so she goes. Oh, dude, that's crazy. And then he started chasing her, almost hitting her. No way, that is weird. Yeah, I don't know. I have a, I have a, you know, conflicting opinion on homeless people, you guys. I mean, I know, I feel bad for them. Obviously, because they don't have a home, they don't have a set place where they live and stuff, but sometimes they are a little bit, you know, they'll push themselves on you, you know? Even if you politely decline, they'll start kind of taunting you a little bit, like, well, I know you have money, you're just being greedy, you know, be ashes, like, whoa, man, you don't need to name call, because for sure you're not getting any of my money now. <laughs> I know it sounds awful, but, you know, it's just... Sometimes, man. How you treat people. Homeless or not homeless. I would much rather give my dollar to somebody who is, you know, kind of kind and appreciative of it. Instead of, you know, going to be chasing after me in my bike or car or whatever, skateboard. <laughs> Tugging on your shirt, making you fall off. Like, jeez. All right, there we are. So Blue had to take out a homeless guy. He's a hero. Should be awarded the Medal of Honor for that blue. Risk your life. Oh, he's like, if I did, I would have pulled over and tackled his butt. Oh, okay, so he didn't really do uh, any harm or anything, so you didn't have to do much. That's good, blue. You're a hero in spirit, though, my man. You are a hero in spirit. And that's good. That means you have a good set of morals and stuff. Hey, I left an item over there. Hmm. I think we can roll. Oh, oops, still broke a little bit of my ankle. My ankle's only kind of broken, Kappa. All right, the greed made me come back for that shriving stone. Playing some Minecraft, oh man, Blue, Blue, you gotta check out, oh, I don't have them right now. I have some Minecraft sunglasses that I got from the fair, and I've been wearing them to uh, work, aka school, and all of my students, they're like, oh, Miss Escape! Are those Minecraft? I'm like, yes. I'm like, I got them at the fair. I was, I thought everybody would have them, but no. They're like, oh, I want some of those Miss Escape. I'm like, well, you're gonna have to get them at the fair, cause, or you know, order them online. <laughs> I can't give you mine. And it's like, some of the kids, man, they will really hound you for your own stuff. They're almost as bad as homeless people. <laughs> Kappa, if, if anyone didn't catch the sarcasm in that. All right, got a couple enemies here. I'm just going on through because I need 17,000 souls in order to level up nowadays. But I'm gonna try to take down these guys over here. These guys, honestly, they're still, um, they're difficult characters for me to fight, especially in a group. They always take me out. I always have to be a little bit careful right here. This guy's slow, I'm not worried about him. He only comes down his high ledge every now and then. So what are you doing in Minecraft, Blue? Oh, Jeebus! Oh, fiend in a Kraken. Okay, good. Oof, I almost fell off with him. Oh, there he is. He did. He finally got off his high ledge. Oh, fudge. Oops, I forgot that that flame travels. I should have just kicked him. How do you kick again like that? There we go. 
It's hard to push those two buttons together at the same time. There we go. I think I have to hold on to it really hard. Excellent. Hey, Mr. G, how are you doing? He says, oh, this gal. What up, Mr. J? Welcome to the Wednesday edition of the Soul Stream. How's your hump day going, you guys? Did anyone have to work today? Oh, I did. I'm tired. Work has been draining me, escapees. I don't know if it's because the bear was this last week and all the kiddos are all excited from the sugar or whatnot, but oh, it has been troublesome. Oh, you're about to stream too? Nice, Mr. Gonzo. I know Doc Savage was streaming. I wanted to jump into his cast, but I was like, I have to get on at least a little bit earlier than I did yesterday. I got on at about 10 yesterday, so I'm like, oh no. Man, my sleeping schedule though is all out of whack, escapees. Sorry about that. No. <laughs> Got some Tato's growing. Ooh. Go Blue LA's doing that greenhouse work. He growing them herbals. Blue, you growing them herbals? Mm -hmm. Hey, did they get rid of the Cygrip emote? Nah. Oh, oh, yes, that was a BTTV emote. I'm sorry about that. If you guys don't know what the Cygrip emote is, it's a, uh, it's a dude cigarette in his mouth. I recently stopped using BTTV. I might go back to it. Oops, because I missed the uh, the GIF emotes. But um, BTTV had a whole bunch of cool emotes too, like the lull emote. This one originally came from BTTV. And uh, now they're kind of, Twitch has kind of, you know, it took away dark, or added dark mode to its own site, which BTTV was really, really useful for. It had the dark mode option. When Twitch didn't, Oh, come on, you were staggered and you know it. That jerk, oh, Jeebus. That jerk knows he was staggered, this guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just prolonged your death, my friend. Oh, see, that guy should have been staggered there too. Why else would I just stand there nonchalantly? I thought he was gonna be staggered. All right, let's go over here. Oh, come on, that should have taken that dog out. Should have taken that dog out with that one hit, but didn't let us, you guys. <laughs> some hydro or some soil grow, ooh. And <laughs> Blue's like, you got it. Oh, we knew it, guessed it, first try. First try hype. Hey, Wayne King, or excuse me, Wayne Klein, how are you doing? Welcome back to the stream. Thank you for hanging out, you guys. Wormtail in the house. Hello, housekeeping. Do -do 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 -do. You need that little bell. <laughs> and then it reminds me of dinner time for some reason. Ringing in a tiny bell. Little French maid outfit. Hello, housekeeping. And Phaedra, how's your night going? Thanks for talking to me earlier on Snap. Sorry if my conversations are boring. Man, the only things I have to talk about you guys during the day, or the only things I think of during the day are uh, things that are going on at work, and man, that is so dull. If it's not a negative, oh, sh I thought I had my shield out, excuse me. If it's not a negative opinion I have, man, it's usually something that, you know, I don't really want to share with the stream. You guys will be like, man, Soul's always thinking so negative. For example, the other day, one of my coworkers had a birthday, and this is a coworker that I like, you know, but I feel like my, uh, my coworkers get together and they plan stuff, and then they expect you to go along with it, you know? They expect you to be happy with whatever they plan. And, which is fine, you know, I can go along with a lot of things, sure, sure. Within reason, of course. But then, the thing that they always do is that they'll plan these things and then they'll say, by the way, your part that you gotta pitch in, in other words, the money you gotta put in is, you know, five bucks, 10 bucks, whatever, and you need to pay it to this person. You know, it's like they don't really involve you in the planning process, but then they expect you to like pay out. I'm like, uh, I want to be involved in the plan too. If I have to pay, you know, to have a birthday party here. But uh, I don't know, just kind of weird stuff going on at work, Skates. Weird stuff going on at work. You too, Wormtail? Oh, oh, flew, fair the flame and squirt. The squirt, indeed. Indeed, Wayne, that's a nice squirt you have there, <laughs> squid. Oops, okay. So I made it to this area. I kind of want to go after a crab. I've been fighting crabs lately. Oh, no, 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 no. That's right. Got 17,000. We can go back. Oops, let's try. 
travel and we're gonna go to the Firelink Shrine. We're gonna talk to our mistress, the fire keeper. This is a beautiful fire keeper. I die every three feet in Dark Souls. Are you new to the series, Worm? I'm definitely new, so that's me too. I've gotta raise my hand there. But uh, we're doing a little bit better. I like to level up uh, in this game, so I do spend a lot of time grinding the same levels over and over. But the good thing is sometimes I find items that I've overlooked, secret areas, things of that nature. I look like a gross zombie at the moment. Please excuse my face. My face too, but Welcome her home, face as well. Speak thine heart. Doing design. good, babe? Nice. Yeah, I'm doing good too. Just been a little bit stressed out from work. That's about it. You think you talk too much at all? I think I talk too much sometimes. All right, let's Very see well. here. I don't want to bore then people with my problems within me. or my boring issues. Take nourishment from these sovereignless souls. Oh, I will indeed. I will take much nourishment. All right, you guys. What do you think I should level? I've been leveling up strength lately. I finally put one more point into vigor, so we got to 723. We could get up to 764 for our HP. That'd be cool. I do, I enjoy Vitality, because look at that, it raises your defense by two points, and you're able to withstand those heavy, atta heavy attacks, heavy hits. Um, but somebody told me I need to be working on my dexterity for those fancier weapons. I do eventually want to switch out my weapon, I have that deep battle axe, but I've had it forever though. Probably time to switch to a, a cooler item. I don't know though. Well, it's good to hear that you're doing good, Beja. Are you working today? You got your day off. That'd be cool. Hopefully day off. I know, right? Death is inevitable, true that, especially in this game. Do you lose? The thing is, though, Wormtail, do you lose all your souls? Oh, that's always the most painful. It's okay to die, but once you lose, once you die that second time, oh, that's when the pain comes in. <laughs> hey guys, the one thing everyone agrees on is Dark Soul. On Dark Souls, what is it? That we always pass. Worm's like, yes, but no. And, praise the sun. <laughs> Blight Town! Oh man. Blight Town? Death is inevitable in life as well. No. There's not enough nudity. You want to see my character nude, Mr. G? Y you really want to see her nude? L look at her face right now. Here, fire, li fire Shrine Lady, can I... Can I borrow this for a second? There we are. Okay, let me just angle myself properly. You, you really want to see nudity on this character, Gonzo. You really want to see some nudity on this beautiful face right here. I hope my camera's not... I hope it's not covering that beautiful, gorgeous face right there. That, that, that's what Mr. Gonzo wants to see nudity of right there, escapees. Hey, I'd create guys into that. <laughs> that's a, that's an eight, a solid 8 out of 10 right there. No. Uh-oh, what happened to Worm? Nightbot must have done something. Oh, I'm sorry about that, Worm Tail. Nightbot has a little bit of a caps limit there. That is an old saying that can fit for your coworkers. <laughs> not my circus, not my monkeys. Oh man, Wayne, I haven't heard that one before. Not my circus, not my monkeys. <laughs> but true that though, sometimes they'll, they'll like plan these elaborate events and then they're like, hey, you owe us 20 bucks and uh, yeah, you gotta pay this person. But hey, we're gonna have a party for somebody. You're pitching in, you know, it's like, but what if I don't wanna pitch in? <laughs> or what if I wanted to do something else, you know, for my coworker, you know, you never know. All right, let's level Welcome up. Home, <laughs> Mr. Gonzo's like, he, he stepped away to the restroom to vomit. He's like, I don't want to see that nude. So that's disgusting. Okay, let's go ahead and level up. I will take much nourishment from that, my Firelink Shrine lady. Firekeeper, there we are. I'm like, what was her proper title again? So I'm leaning more towards vitality, I think, my friends. Oh, it's an old Polish saying, nice. Base is, oh my god, so I work on call, right? So I was on my way to work, they called me saying that our detainee was discharged from the hospital. So I got all ready for work for nothing. And I hope your student sugar hat goes down. I hope so too, Bay. And uh, oh man, that happened to me at Dairy Queen once when I was working uh, summers. They called me in because I was supposed to take, uh, I was going to take one of my coworkers shifts because she was out sick or something. And then I show up and they're like, what are you doing here? You're not scheduled. I'm like, well, Dustin, who's our manager, he's now the owner. And uh, I go, Dustin said that, you know, I had to be here. And they were pretty much like, no, no, you don't got to be here today. I'm like, but isn't so-and-so out? They're like, yeah, we don't need you, though. So I went all the way home. But I guess after that, um, 
the crew leader got in trouble for doing that. So I guess I was supposed to be there, because I'm like, dude, the manager told me I was supposed to be here. It's not like I'm making this up. But no, I feel you, babe. It sucks, though. You get ready for work, you get all hyped. I've done that for snow days, too. Like, um, last year we had a couple snow days. Got all ready for work and stuff. I wasn't really hyped for it. I was, like, more, like, dragging my butt. But uh, it got ready, got ready to drive down there. And actually drove a little bit, got the call halfway. And uh, luckily I had my, I knew I was expecting, you know, just in case there was calls and stuff. I had my Bluetooth and all that, answered the phone. And, uh, yep, sure enough, it was that automated system. We are closed, blah, 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 school district is closed for... Called winter delay or something like that, and I was like, "Oh, about to turn around in the snow." It was awful. It was awful, you guys. We can expect another good winter like that. All right, uh, I'm gonna start up in the dexterity. Uh, I want to, but it seems like a waste right now. That just ups our attack just a little bit, our strength and whatnot. I would love to go vitality for that defense, but man, we're just gonna have a tank character, a strange tank herald. No, let's go with the dexterity. No, I don't want dexterity right now. Let's go with the vitality. I like that extra defense. I don't know why. I don't know what's so attractive about that extra defense, you guys. Alright, thank you, Firekeeper. You are amazing, as always. Um, Let's see, my friends. I might be able, since I have a little bit higher dexterity, or excuse me, vitality now, we might be able to start equipping somewhat better helmets and things like that. I mean, nice to hold the uh, Lothric Knight helm, but it's... You guys can't see it because it's behind my camera, but it's a little bit above my equip load or my weight ratio, so I won't be able to roll properly. We need to be able to roll. I'm going to try this one on just real quick. Huh. A funny style. <laughs> That's a ridiculous style. Oh cool, we're right at the cusp of 70. I'll stick with this helmet for a little bit. At least it'll, you know, get rid of that zombie face for a few, you know, couple of uh, minutes here. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and rest up. We'll take off again, escapees. We'll take off. I'm sorry, worm. It was just the, uh, the caps emote, I think. The one with all the caps. Oh, it's the, yeah, Nightbot doesn't uh, enjoy those caps, Wormtail. I'm sorry. Sorry. Oh, Bay had to get ready for nothing. Dang it. <laughs> I'd be annoyed. I was. I was pretty annoyed, too. But, well, the only reason I guess I wasn't annoyed is because I got to go home. And I didn't live very far from Dairy Queen. It's actually kind of close. I could walk if I wanted to. I'd get sweaty, though, if I would. <laughs> You've been playing dirty. Always check with at least two. <laughs> then my dirt will disappear off my shield. And your shield will be all nice and sparkly again, Mr. Gonzo. Oh, that's cool, Wayne Klein. Not Polish, but you learned from a pilot show. <laughs> Bowl time! Oh man, Mr. G. Those sig rips. Getting that sig rip in the channel. If you guys can't see that uh, emote, it has to do with better Twitch TV. I don't have any more either, but we're just going to pretend I can still see the emote. Um, I'm using currently the Twitch beta and all that stuff, and I'm using dark mode and all the stuff I used to use on beta. Okay, so yesterday we did make it over to the uh, Crystal Sage, but I'm going to go to the Halfway Fortress and we'll get over to the Crystal Sages area. Then I have to explore that area because uh, we ended the cast at about 1 a.m. last night and I had to go to sleep. So uh, I honestly, I was supposed to wake up at about 5. I pushed it till five, oh no, I pushed it till six, you guys, and I ended up taking a real quick shower, and I had to like really, really quick dry my hair and straighten it and stuff, and I just slapped some makeup on, and I went to work like that. I didn't get to chill around. Usually I have some time in the morning to chill and drink some tea, and actually, you know, wake up and stuff, but today it was like, boom, 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 you get to work, soul. You stayed up till late. No. Blue says, ha ha ha, excuse me. Why, Blue, did you fart? Blue, whew. Gross. Oh, home sweet home. I know where you're doing blue slacking. Schlacker. No, good thing you made it safe. Good to know, blue. Good to know. Sleep in your own abyss. Oh, I feel you, man. Have a good night, Wayne Klein. Thank you for hanging out with us. And I hope to see you tomorrow in the soul stream. 
ever onward, ever forward to bed. I know I wanted to go to bed early too, but I don't know. It's like, oh, come on. You have to be staggered. Okay, well, he died. Revenge. I want to go to bed early too, escape. When I think about it, when I start thinking about going to bed and then I lay here and I realize it's only 11, for some crazy reason in my mind, I'm like, man, it's so early. You know, if I go to sleep at 12, I'll still have five hours. Five hours is decent. Yeah. Ooh, I forgot the pike. Oops. Oh, come on. He penetrated us, Kappa. Oh, man, that dog's good. I was gonna go in for a, one of those jumping attacks, but nope. Dog was not having it. Alright, well we can jump attack this this dude. Oh! Oh, well there we go, I almost missed. I missed that second hit, but not the third. Excellent. Oh man, B! I've been, uh, that's probably why I'm so tired all the time. I've been running on four hours of sleep, I feel. Um, like since I was a kid. I don't know, I'm just like a really strange night owl type of person. The only reason I'm up early, you guys, is because I have to be for work and whatnot. Maybe I should get like a night owl job. <laughs> be up in the wee hours of the night instead of you know, all backwards like I am. Right. Uh oh, my light blinked. You guys ever have lights in your house, like your lamp and stuff that flickers for no reason? I usually just think of the ghosts around and stuff, but you never know. No. That'd be awful. I hope there's no ghosts around. Supposedly, the people that own my house, my house is pretty old, Escapees. It's about 50 years old. Well, actually, now it's about 70 years old. Because it was uh, made in 1950, according to my mom, <laughs> who's been here for like 30 years. And, uh,. Oh, where was I going with that? Oh, and uh, I apparently, one of the backstories is that the owner of this house, Mr. Isaacson, or the previous owner of the house, passed away in one of the rooms. I think it was my grandma's room, to be honest, because that's like the master bedroom, and uh, nobody sleeps in there nowadays. Mom wants me to move into it, but, like, I don't know. But so, yeah, we always have a little running joke about how the house is haunted, but fingers crossed, I hope it isn't I've never seen anything too creepy. Not since I was a kid, at least. Uh, anything that I have seen in the house, I can pretty much explain away. Shadows. <laughs> Soul's taking some happy pills. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's how I run in those four hours of sleep, right? Right, Mr. G? Wink, wink. Nudge, nudge. I'm like an infant. Oh, man, Beja, that is me on the weekends. You have to wake me up. Like, if I... <laughs> No, I can wake up by myself before noon, but if I had- oh, come on, I missed the crab's butt. If I had my way, man, I would sleep until like 1pm if I could on the weekend. Oh, sleep is a beautiful thing. I just- I don't know, I just like being up in the nighttime, though. One- one more. Oh gosh, I got a little greedy there. Um, yeah, let's flask up. These guys give you 800 souls if you take them out. He got me with his fat bubbles, dang it. Oh, oh, I'm going into a tight squeeze area that I don't want to go into. Oh, I thought I could hit his hand. I missed. Alright, let's hit him to the side. Oh, he missed. Oh. Alright. There we go. Oh, got him. Need those souls. Oh, he's got something for us today. Titanite shard. That's alright. Alright, where's the other crab? Oh, here he is. He's probably gonna come visit us pretty soon. <laughs> I knew she was a ghost! It's little G! How dare you! Cover that ear. Cover that exposed ear. That's the only lie there, is that uh, I don't really expose my ears too often. 
the little G is a little bit inaccurate right there. <laughs> the crab can roll over. Yes, we gotta get our butter, our forks ready. Start boiling up the swamp. But hold on, don't boil it yet. I'm still here. I'm still in here. Hold on, you guys. No, I feel you, Major. Me too. I do need a lot of sleep. That's why it's been, I'll be honest, it's been a little bit tough starting to, the cast. Because I'm like, oh man, I don't want to have a tired cast. I don't want to come off, you know, all sleepy. Uh-oh. Oh, here he comes. Oh, jeez. Did I get... Alright, hold on. I'm not friends. Friends? Oh, he caught us. Dang it. Well, it's all over. No. Luckily, that attack doesn't kill us all the way. Well, you know what? I do need to... I gotta run off for a second here and S just up. Alright, we're good. Ooh. Got a lot of uh, stamina here, so let's see if we can't. Oh, jeez, I think I, I can't see where I'm at exactly. Somewhere in front or behind <laughs> one of those areas. Oh, jeez, alright, alright. Hold on there. Hold on there, crab! Oh! Oh, knocked him down. One more hit, come on, come on. Okay, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Alright, we got him. Two crabs in one. Got the crab pot. Cool. Alright, we don't have to worry about those guys anymore. So I'm gonna go back real quick, escapees. We are going to head back to where we beat the Crystal Sage yesterday. Um, because after that, after we defeated him or her, I just ended up taking off because I had to go to sleep real fast. So uh, yeah, let's go back and we'll check the area thoroughly. So I'm sure there's some items or something that we must have missed over there. So we will, oh geez. So we will check it out, my friends. Oh, come on. After we kill the crabs, we're gonna let the dog take us out, right? That's always how it goes. Kill the tough enemies and you let the easy ones kill you. So save a little face. Oopsie. And CM Gary, good to see you. I missed you up there, darn it. Typical gamer thing, I know. True that. Are you guys night owls too? I'm a night owl. I hope I'm not the only one, escapees. There you go. Some solid G's in the channel for you guys. Thank you for hanging out with us today. Oh, jeez. Well, here we are. I thought I had my shield. I'm so sorry about that. Suffer from the condition known as Bethesda fingers. No, I can't. I uh, can't blame it on that anymore. I still have been playing some Fallout, but not recently. So I guess I can't blame my Bethesda fingers. You could just say lack of memory. <laughs> Lack of good memory skills. Welcome, new follower, and thank you for hitting the follow button on the Soul Stream. I hope you enjoy being an escapee, my friend. That's what we call ourselves in the channel. I'm an escapee too, don't worry. I've escaped reality multiple times. The lands of, well, different lands. Cyrodiil, whatever the Dark Souls region is called. Multiple other areas. Oh yeah, feel free to throw that new follower hype in the channel if you want, escapees. Show our newcomer some love. So you go through this... Oh god, I gotta forget. I mean, I can't forget. I gotta remember, I should say. Uh, that guy screams and he wakes up all those sleeping people, so we don't want that to happen. I didn't know I couldn't be interrupted, at least from his magic cast. Well, I did that. Usually, if I'm charging up this powerful attack right here, if somebody hits me, I usually don't get to go through with that attack. So I was surprised when I got hit by magic and didn't interrupt it. Very good to know. Turk, how are you doing? Good to see you, Turk Lurky. Oh man, Bay. You and I had the longest snap streak. I had two other snap streaks going, and I didn't ruin the, the other ones, but my friends ruined the other snap streaks that I had. Now I have one left, and I have yours left, too. The other person that I have a snap streak with, we're on number six. And I think Vader and I are number 10 or number 11 by now. But yes, I had a snap streak with the person, and we went and ruined it. <laughs> Not my fault, though. Oops. 
They opened my picture and they didn't say a word, so it ain't my fault that happens. That's just, you know, that's just a terrible situation. Hello. Got a sorcerer here. Oh, jeez. This other sorcerer can never mind his own business. And he's got the heavy attacks, too. He's got the thick soul arrow. Hello, my friend. Although we're not really friends. But I do dig your big old hat, though. Hopefully one of these days he'll drop his big hat. It looks like a giant flappy mushroom. <laughs> Coming in with three on the heist. Nice. GG on that heist, you guys, if you win some soul gems. Alright, and if I haven't asked you yet, Escape these, how is your Wednesday going? Mine's going pretty good. I'll be honest, I'm happy it's almost, you know, it's almost Friday, it's almost weekend time. I'm hoping to go see, I just need to find somebody to go with, but, uh, because my mom already saw it. She went to see it when I was at the Renaissance Fair. And, uh, so I'm looking for somebody to go with me to see the movie it. I'll probably ask the first person that I went to the Renaissance Fair with, because he seems to be, you know, not very busy most of the time. <laughs> I'm like, alright. You're not busy, I'm not busy. Okay, so, we cleared out that area. If you keep continuing straight on this pathway, this is where we met the Crystal Sage last night. It took us about five tries to take him out. So that's not too bad, although we were at level 50, so it's not like we were level 24 or anything, you know, struggling to get by and stuff. <laughs> Mr. God, thank God! Thank God! Oh, excellent! Oh, you guys did get those soul gems! Cool, I see that victory in there. Dang, Mr. Gonzo, did you heist the whole thousand? Javis H. That is a lot. Let me throw some more soul gems, you guys. And uh, once again, thank you for coming in. Thank you for hanging out tonight. We are playing some more Dark Souls. More Dark Souls. Faces, that sucks. So my new tactic is to snap at midnight. Just in case I forget during the day. Oh, it's all good, Phaedra. I know, me too. I've been trying to snap at lunch. I just have, like, whatever food I'm eating, a banana or something. <laughs> Soul's asking out a date. No. No, it's not like that. I've known that this person used to be my neighbor, actually. Uh, he used to live uh, across the street when we were little kids. But uh, not anymore, you guys. He moved away. Eh, he's cool, but I don't know. I don't really see him too much in that light. In that light. Alright, let's see. He is a gamer, though, which is uh, pretty nice. I enjoy that. Because uh, sometimes we're able to play some co-op games. Some co-op games, especially if we're hanging out at the house, which uh, happens occasionally. So I need to check out this area, escapees. I haven't been up there, so let's go up here. Haven't been up here. And I haven't been through that other door that's on the left. Okay, so nothing up here. At least, nothing yet. <laughs> Did Soul turn red? No. No, Turk! You can't probe anything! You guys can't prove it! I'm kidding, by the way. Oh, good! Well, thank you, CM Gary. I'm glad. I'm glad to hear it. This is my Thursday starting off well. Excellent. By the way, yes, that's right. Happy, good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, depending on what side of the world you're on. And happy Wednesday or Thursday, once again, depending. Oh, no! Oh, jeez, okay. Whew. Ooh, ooh, a twinkling titanite. Not bad. Is that... Do I hear another one? A miscreant is ahead. I could I could swear I hear another one. Oh, I do hear another one. Drop your item. Another twinkling titanite. Cool. That it did make us fall off of that cliff area, so... Alright, I remember those ladies. They might be upgraded since they're in this section. We've only seen them in the undead settlement, so lord knows what these ladies will have in store for us. Alright. Oh, apparently this is a little bit higher level. Oh, that's nice. Well, we've, we've fought both these types of enemies before. So it shouldn't be too bad, I don't think. Although you never know. Oh, Got me with his butcher knife. Oh, oh jeez. I thought I had that extra swing in there. Oh gosh! 
Oh, no, 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 please don't. Oh, please tell me I didn't roll off a damn hill, soul escape. The greed is gonna get me. Wait, that guy's dead already, right? Okay, this is the little creature I killed. <laughs> the greed was gonna get me, I was gonna kill him again. Or try, at least. Oh, come on, I wasn't in his line of attack, but whatever, if you say so. There. How many souls did he give us? I didn't see that. I'm curious. 320? Not bad. 320 souls. Yeah, aha! Says Turk. She is blushing. You can't prove anything, Turk. He's lying through his teeth, you guys. <laughs> He's lying through his beak. Don't believe that, Turkey. Don't believe him. Dang it. Well, oh man. I got up. Or I, I came from that area. So I don't know how I'd get back up there, but well, let's continue forward. What's the what's the worst that could happen, right? What does this say? Treasure ahead. This way? I don't know if I trust you. Let me see. I'll edge to the corner. If I fall off, I'm gonna be pretty livid. Nah, I don't believe it. I don't believe there's treasure. I don't see any ledge down there. There's a ledge down here, but oh man, you guys. Oh, oh man. Probably the butcher guy, because he's slower. The knife guy, he's too fast. He's like, whoosh, whoosh. the guy with the cross on his back? Yes. Or the knife, yeah, the cross knife dude? Yep. I don't like him. I don't like him at all. That guy, you have to roll too much. <laughs> with the butcher guy, at least, you know, you roll behind him once, and he's like, rrr, rrr, in that same area, and you're like, whoosh, whoosh, porking him in the butt. Shanking him in the butt. <laughs> but we know her secrets. Oh no, me secrets. Me secrets are out. They're out in the open. I'm gonna go. Oh my gosh. Oh no, no, no. Oh, she took me out. Underestimated her. Yeah, you earned that laugh. But you didn't earn that hat, you crazy lady. <laughs> Guys, thank you for hanging out. Dang it, first death of the night. That's always embarrassing. Thank you for hanging out on the stream, Escapees. Let me throw down the first wave of informational panels. Um, yeah, if you're enjoying the cast, or if you're new in the channel, please consider hitting the follow button for us here on the Soul Street. That would be awesome. And if you want to follow us off social media, we have Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all that good stuff, you guys. Capital S E L underscore three S C four P three. Capital S E L underscore three S C four P three. If you want that, if you want that. But yes, I've been running out of things to post on Instagram, you guys. It's usually a lot of selfies nowadays. And uh, I never used to be like that. I used to have cool stuff that I used to post, I guess. Now it's like, oh man, I gotta start doing more stuff uh, IRL. Have to start looking at the sky more often so we can get some good pics nowadays. Okay. So let's see here. Oh, d so the other guy saw us. Jeez, but the first dude didn't. All right, let's keep one butcher guy occupied. What about you, Faye? Would you rather fight the butcher guy or the guy with the sword on his back? Because these guys, they definitely look scarier than the sword, or than the, uh, oh, come on, soul. Uh, well, at least he fell down this time. Good. Oh. Why didn't I defend against that? Okay. Drop any items. Wait, wait. Spoke too soon. Okay, nope. He didn't drop anything. Gotta make sure the <laughs> rip. Don't be embarrassed. Or yes, I'm always embarrassed when I die. But what a shame. What a waste of souls. Oh, let's go. Could have tried to surprise him. I wasn't in the mood for any surprising though. Ha! Now he fell down. I'll go down there too. Hello! Okay. Cool. Drops anything. The greed is real. <laughs> she will take both souls. I will take both. Wait, both what? Let me see what I'm agreeing to. <laughs> you could take him on. Oh, the cross guy. Ooh. Blue chose the cross guy, man. <laughs> Pedro will take both. Pedro, don't do it. 
the butcher guy is more intimidating. Man, I hate that freaking butcher knife that he has, though. It is pretty scary. Alright, let's see if we can't get down there. I need to get my souls first. Most important thing to do. There. Let's get a proper stance on her. Oh, I knew I was in her reach. Always sucks when you know you're about to get hit. You can't do anything about it. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, she's throwing the black magic at us. That's fine. It's when she does that fire hug is when you want to really, really get away. Yeah, who's laughing now? Who's laughing now? Not me, because I don't know what's up ahead. But at least it's not you either. All right. Oh, yes, I saw a treasure. Fingers crossed for something good. It's a herald. I'm a herald. Herald stuff. Yay. We already have all that junk, though. Because we started out the game with this junk. <laughs> cool. Hmm, it's a herald. What an obvious message. All right. It looks like somebody passed on here. There's a bridge. A bean pole? Hmm. I don't know what that means. So I'm gonna chug a lug and uh, prepare for the worst. Another miscreant. Uh oh. That always means something bad. Oh, don't tell me we're coming up to a real boss. Oh, come on, please. We already fought like a small boss. I don't wanna come up to a big boss. There's another bonfire though, you guys. Let's hype it up for an extra bonfire that we found. Yay, bonfire hype. Now we can chill for a second. Now we can chill for a second, escapees. What is my favorite Zelda game? Oh man, Vedra. I, I know one for sure though. Uh, my favorite Zelda game was uh, Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. And I played that one on, I played it on the Game Boy Advance, but it was, well, I paid, played it on the Game Boy Color, but it was, uh, and on the Game Boy Advance, but it was a Game Boy Color game. And, uh, oh man, it was awesome. It was about Link. And he was on a boat or something, and the boat ends up crashing. And uh, he, I think, had amnesia. He washes up on a beach, he has no idea who he is. And he finds out, he meets all these characters that look exactly like other characters from the previous Zelda games. But instead of being known as Zelda, the girl that looks like Zelda, her name is Marin. And it's just a really, really cool story. You end the end, it's really awesome too. You end up, well, I don't want to spoil it, but you know, it's, you just go through this amazing, What's your guys' favorite Legend of Zelda games? If you played them. If you played them. I hope not, Turk. Man, why you gotta say that, Turk? I don't think it'll be a boss time. We just fought a mini boss. Why do we gotta fight another one? I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry a little bit. I'll be sad, though, if we have to fight a boss. <laughs> no, it'll be okay. We'll try our best. Right? What else can we do, huh? Apparently... Oh, jeez! I was gonna say, apparently there's another pathway. And there's some kind of crazy person here, too. Yes? Oh! Oh, I like that. I like that effect that your cool sword had. He's got two knives. He's fancy. Fancy thief with his two knives. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no! And you're throwing knife, too. You jerk. Oh, come on, that didn't hit me. Yeah, it did. <laughs> oh. Ooh, uh, reach. Oh, oh, oh. oh, I missed. I went too slowly there. Ha, he, he stabbed the bonfire. You guys see that? He stabbed the bonfire. At least I've never done that. At least I've never done that. Oh, did he kill me? Wow, that's rude. That's very rude, though. To be honest about that. I think I already. How many of I? How many Estuses have I drank yet? About three of them so far. I right, found one opening. Good. You have openings. Like not as much as you. <laughs> yeah, touche. Touche. Come on, heavy attack on him. 
Oh darn, I tried. I tried to get in on a heavy attack, but it wasn't working. Oh, oh, he's got me. Alright, luckily we are next to the bonfire, so F it. Drink as many of those estuses that I need. Yeah, just in case you're not dead. Okay, extra hit. I didn't get any cool items though, dang it. Well, that's sad. That was awesome. I don't know what happened there. I don't know why that guy showed up. Who was that dude? Who was that guy? Ooh, Twilight Princess. Ooh, I love Twilight Princess. That was a good one too. I played that one on the Nintendo Wii. That was the last Zelda game that I played though. <laughs> Feels bad, man. Turk with that two gain. Excellent. Got two soul gems right there. <laughs> real boss hype. No way. No real boss, you guys. What, what uh, game did Bader say was her first, or her favorite? Oh, she said I haven't played any Zelda games all the way through, but I'm playing Link to the Past on the, ooh, on the SNES. Yes, Link to the Past was awesome as well. It's really good so far. Well, I don't want to spoil it, but big spoiler alert for Zelda games is that they're kind of all the same. You start out with, I think it's the eight small bosses, right? Eight dungeons. And then it takes you to like three dungeons, three bigger boss dungeons and then the very main person which is always the same person but I won't say you know who it is well actually no they did change it up in Link's Awakening is that an online player was that him was that an online person blue it shouldn't be it could have been but it shouldn't be no they I think they were expecting that enemy to be there Sometimes I wonder if online players pop up. I heard that it can only happen if... Oh, we got the ashes. I think we got to give these ashes to the blacksmith, dude. The blacksmith. All right, let's see. Mm, I did sleep, huh? All right, I did rest. Sleep. We slept. Yeah, we'll go back in a little bit. I think we're fine right now. All right, I see an enemy up there. Somebody with an axe. But they do look kind of tough. They look like a regular person, too. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, Found an opening. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, what a jerk. Dude, they sliced my face open. Oh, come on, come on, come on. You gotta let me get away after that. Oh, you fudge. Yeah, well, I'm healing a second time because of that. <laughs> You did that, now I'm doing this. Come on, stamina. Oh darn, I ran out of stamina there. Oh yes, yes. Ha! This must be a noob like me throwing throwing knives up close. Who does that besides noob players? Oh! Got me with the kick though. Got me with the kick. Oh, ooh, 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 that was close. Shouldn't un underestimate this person. Oh. Oh, come on. You farge. Oh, I should have. Yes, 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 yes. That's what I needed. Just that opening right there. Good. I was like, I should have attacked when he was throwing that knife. Then through the second one, I was like, aw, thank you. How many souls do we get for that one, escapees? That was kind of a lot, huh? Oh, 1,500. Excellent. A spider shield, that's cool. Ironically, it looks a little bit like a ladybug to boot. Let's check it out real quick. So I have the Lothric Knight shield. I have it upgraded twi er, twimes, twimes two. No, twice is what I was gonna say. And uh, let's check this one out though. This is a, a good shield for if you're gonna do um, parrying. This move right here. As soon as the enemy is, you know, lunges, you go like that, you block them and then you're like, get to hit him. Move I haven't mastered yet, but uh, yeah, let's go sit down. <laughs> go sit down and pray about it a little bit, my friends. Let's pray about it. Yeah, that's what I thought too, right? See, I'm Gary. Uh, other players, friend or foe, only join your game after you have an ember. Do they go away after your ember goes away? Like after you die, you can't have your companions or your friends in your game anymore? I'm curious. I uh, I haven't played any like legit online mode just yet. Can't read it. Oh, I guess I can. Hey, whoa! We found a creepy area, you guys. Like a cheating area to get up there. 
Oh, maybe not. <laughs> if I'm not careful, I'm gonna end up glitching myself out, so I should just stop that. Just stop that, soul. I got all excited. I'm like, oh, we found a secret area. Cool. Well, guys, thank you for hanging out. And uh, let me fix the headset just in case, you know, I can't hear the stream. But sometimes I wonder if the headset's all out. See, so that's crazy, Gary. So they do leave after your ember's gone. That's sad. Because isn't there like a limited... I heard there was a limited amount. Well, I read somewhere there's a limited amount of embers. Kind of limited. I think you can keep buying them from the maiden. The handmaiden? Or what was her name again? The handmaid, excuse me. I think you can still buy them from the handmaid, but... There we are. Oh, come on. Man, my... Battle axe is a little bit slow on the reach, or lacking on the reach, I should say. Mm. Let's see here. Oh, come on, there's another dude too. There's another one. Alright, we'll get the dog. Okay. Nope, dog didn't drop anything. All right, let's, uh, oh, jeez. Let's go up this way and see if we can't find a route to get up top. Oh, gosh. Man, this is like the death alley or something. Oh, come on. These two dogs are going to take me out. This third dog's going to take me out for sure. Oh, jeez. Chill out with that damn fire arrow, my friend. Whew. And those fire arrows are deadly. The only thing is they stun you for like a second. So I'm like, dang it. Rolling back. Okay. Continue forth. Now we can take him out proper style. Oh, I was gonna run and jump. Dang it. Well, he blocked me on that one. Large soul of an unknown traveler. Those sometimes give you about 2,000 souls. But I'll take it, even though I was shot in the arm right there. I'll raise my arrowed arm to the sky. Praise the sun that we may live another day. Oh darn, I thought we could jump to that extra little overlook over there. I know, right? Boss defeated. I know, high fives all around. Right, Turk? No, I wish. Nope, there's no boss, I don't think. There's not enough embers to see him, Gary, if you ask me. I know I read that there was kind of, um, like, lacking on the embers. I'm like, oh, well, that's not good. That's not good. Then again, I guess the good part about that is I don't have too many people to play with. I won't have to waste that many embers, or not waste, but use them. Bad part is that I don't have that many people to play with. <sighs> All right, no, but I have you guys, so that's good. Okay, so it seems that we cleared out this area. Although I can't say that, you know, all the way for certain because we didn't check out this side down yonder. Oh, I guess we did, huh? We just kind of came through it. All right, let's see. Oh, look, there's a whole other side over here, too. Oh, <laughs> two doorways does, Soul. Come on. Come on, Soul. Open your eyes. I'm like, there's a whole other side here. <laughs> the same doorways just split, split in half. Oh, this guy's probably gonna scream. He's one of those callers. Oh. Maybe he wasn't a caller. Maybe he was gonna transform. I thought he was a caller. That's why I took off and uh, killed him. I think he was gonna transform. Uh oh. For fun, we should have let him just to see what he would have looked like, but. I don't know. He had some fire going on too. Next time escape these, I'm sure he'll spawn again. Uh oh. These guys are praying to somebody over here. Ooh, an Estus shard. We found an Estus shard. They were playing to, praying to this Ophelisk apparently. 
secrets and holds, only they know. Alright, it looks like there's a drop off area right here. There's also something up there that I want to check out. Uh oh. Somebody died and dropped some souls. I don't know who it was. Alright, hold on. Before we head up to this level, let's check inside this well and this church. Hello? Hello! 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 <laughs> Is there anybody in there? Oh, look at that! An item. Ooh, I don't know if I want to open it. Well, you know what? Maybe we can't. Oh god, we can. That's the worst part. There's a bonfire. What does this say? Friend. Try love. Such beautiful device tonight. All right, you guys got to another bonfire. Hype it on the channel. Woo -woo. Bonfire hype the skeepies. We did it. Would I still? No, I wouldn't have Vaja. I know I'm a vain mother trucker. I wouldn't have until I known until I knew that we were gonna be able to finish that quest like soon. <laughs> no, I messed it up. I didn't know that my character's face was gonna get hideous. That's the same reason I won't go vampire style in uh, any of the Elder Scrolls games, because your face gets terrible. I'm like, man, I spent so much time on my character creation. I don't wanna look ugly. Even though my character is pretty, you know, she's not, she, she's not pretty. She's pretty, well, you know. Not attractive, but still, it's okay. I like her. Ooh, we found a notched whip. Ooh. Okay, um, I'm gonna go actually go back up that area and we'll come back and check these doors because I'm assuming that these doors have, you know, a completely different pathway that we can go through. Who knows? Hey, Martian, how are you? Yes, go ahead, feel free. He says, soul, may I confess something serious? Gary says, if I can't get a boss down on my own, there's usually someone around to help you. Oh, Beige is almost a regular. You're almost to that 10,000 hype. Oh, interesting. That is awesome, Bay. Crows. Crows and a lot of dead people escape these. Hey, that's how we start the game, by crawling out of a, a grave, so... I would not underestimate these, these dead. Are they just standing there? Hold on there, escapees. They do, they just stand there. And I think they crawl out forever. Look at that. One dies, another appears. It's never ending. How many souls do we get for killing them though? <laughs> 20 only? Darn it. 20 souls for killing these harmless undead. Well, technically they're not harmless. Look at that, they're vomiting stuff. Gross. Oh, I think if one vomits, it brings them alive again? I don't know. There's gotta be some kind of crazy rules to these damn skeletons. Oh man, let's just go. <laughs> it's never gonna end. Let's get out of here. Hurry. Here they come. What if they're just, what if we turn around and there's like a hundred of these guys and they just never end? Oh jeez, what well, way to go, Soul. See, look, I'm gonna look at the spots where they vomited. Oh, jeez. No, I guess not. I was curious. I wanted to know if when they vomit, more dead arise from that spot, but nope, nobody arose. Alright, I finally see a treasure. Did that guy drop something? Nope. Hello. Oh, 
Ooh, and a store a great sword. Cool. Upgrade that, make it better. Oh yeah, sorry, I can press the A button. Thank you. Alright, that looks like the main area, so let's continue forward here. This is like a weird cemetery maze. Oh, Martian, you're getting proud? Yes, I think I remember you saying that. I think you came out in this little stream the other day, too. Well, congratulations, guys. Throw some Kappa Prides in for Martian. Congratulations for coming out. He is gay and proud, escapees. That is awesome, Martian. Yeah, I think I remember you saying that. Uh, Gameware is also uh, homosexual, too. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. No, just kidding. Martian. I think there's an item to revert your character to. Original beauty. I don't write Kappa Kappa. Yeah, I did hear about that too. It was called, I can't remember what it was called, but there is an item. And I heard you can have the, the fire link or the fire keeper do it too. Oh, it was called something purge. Uh, stone of purge or something like that. Purging stone. And uh, thank you for the new follow, by the way. Did we make it to 7,200? We're almost rounding that bend, my friends. Almost rounding that bend to that 7,200 follower mark. Oh, we did, guys! Thank you so much, new follower. You are a 7,200 follower in the soul stream. Throw down a round of applause, escapees. I'm gonna throw down 200 soul gems for that lovely number. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it a ton. And uh, yeah, I hope you're having a good day. Thank you for kicking it. Thank you for hanging out. We've been streaming for how many hours, you guys? Or how many minutes, I should say. Only an hour, nice. Yeah, we haven't done too much yet. We are just checking out the area behind the Crystal Sage, which we killed yesterday on cast. Now we're just trying to find some more items, kill a couple extra enemies. If I want to level up, I have to get to 1,700, or excuse me, 17,000 souls. A little bit of time before we get there. Jeez, there's a lot here. If I'm not careful though, drama could happen. Could indeed. Look at that guy! Some freak! Look at that freak! You see this guy? He's got somebody coming out of his stomach. Gross! I don't even want to see his attacks. Look at another dude! Another dude looks like that. I don't even want to know who's been getting into that necrophiliac stuff, but this is what happens. This is what happens when people decide to go that route. <laughs> it doesn't end up well. Alright, let me just get to the back of this area. Is there anything important back here? No, not really, huh? Oh, pathway. <laughs> no, not really, but yes, a giant pathway that we could take. Alright, beep beep, mother truckers, I gotta get through. Ooh, items galore. Cool. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Those dead dudes are like, what do we do? Ooh, executioner's greatsword, that's cool. Uh-oh, and a fading soul. Alright, let's get out of here. I, I, I think I, yep, overstayed my welcome. Too bad we can't throw a couple of grenades in here, escape these, and just call it good, but... How prim and proper everybody's gotta be. Oh, and that's what happened. Now we know what this attack is like. <laughs> oh, again with the hugging. Ew, that looks disgusting. That is gross. All right, let's get out of here. Come on. We're getting out of here, friends and family. Oh, no, 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 there goes my souls, escapees. All right, I ain't got time to play like that. Oh! Oh, come on. Oh, he slapped me in the booty. Right as I was trying to take off. Take off. Thank you, regular skeletons, for being nice and chill. 
No thank you to the crazy skeletons. Alright, yep, I like chilling with these chill skeletons. Although a cool, I, I do, I do have a, uh, a strange desire to go back and fight them though. I must admit. Oh, I got that blood loss going on again. Darn it. How dare you? How many souls do I get for that guy? 20? Only 20? That's a little bit. That's not worth it. <laughs> That's not worth it at all. Let's go. Ooh, what are they restocking? <laughs> oh, you naughty soul. What did I do, Blue? Dome! Long time indeed. How have you been, Dome? Good to see you. We're on Dark Souls 3 now. Is that surprising? It's not a Bethesda game. What? What? What, Soul Escape? Is this even the right channel anymore? Alright, nobody dropped an item. What a sad day. I'm gonna assume that we got everything in that area. Oops, sorry, laptop. Kicked my laptop, so I was moving my leg over. Alright, let me go ahead and chill for a second here. We don't have enough souls to go and actually level up, though. Psst, dang it. How have you been doing, Dome? Good to see you. I thought she was playing COD. I know, right? Playing some COD. So sorry is in here. How are you doing? So sorry, kid. Yeah, Cuphead. I've heard a lot of Cuphead. Mr. Gonzo, did you start heisting? Or sorry, did you need to start streaming yet? Pre-order the Super Mario Odyssey edition, so I won't get until the 27th. Oh, man. Pre-order hype, though. <laughs> Google says you're right, Soul. Yay, Google. Excellent. Thank you guys for allowing us to hit that 7200 mark. Yes, Phaedra did get one. She did indeed. Me too, so that's the only one I have as well. Just an Xbox One at the moment. I mean, I have a GameCube and a Wii, but I don't pull them out <laughs> anymore. Well, the game, or, I mean, the Nintendo Wii is still hooked up and stuff. Tis indeed. Played ARMS in your friend's Switch. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know what you did. I might. Pokemon, or er, Mario Kart 8 and the Pokemon in uh, Tournament, excuse me. I don't know why I wanted to say Untournament. The Pokemon Tournament won. And I'm hoping if the 3DS dies, Pokemon will go to the Switch. Yeah, I used to play Pokemon Stadium for a little bit. That was my nephew's game that I would borrow. And uh, I enjoyed it. I thought it was cool. I was like, whoa, this is like 3D. Oh, I'm sorry, Gary. It's like, I don't even know where to get one here in Germany. Yeah, Mario Kart 8, I used to love it. I did like, I didn't really like the physicalness of the Wii. I kind of, I don't know, I didn't enjoy it after a while. Like, I thought it would, because I was a straight-up Nintendo person back in the day. But, uh, no, after they came out with the Wii and stuff, I was a little bit disappointed. That's when I started going over to consoles and whatnot. I mean, like, the 360 and all that. I'm like, no, I think I want more traditional games. But, uh, I did enjoy, though, however, the Mario Kart driving on the Wii. That was cool. <laughs> I had those little wheels and everything. Okay, let's go ahead. Oh, I was going to say we're going to travel back, but no, we don't have to. Let's go ahead and open some of these doors and see what's behind them. Door number one doesn't open from this side. How about door number two? Door number two also does not open from this side. Very interesting. So that means that we do have to go through the cemetery and that there is a different pathway. Quite possibly. All right, well, if you say so. Oop. Oh, yeah, that's what I wanted to check out, though. Let's check out the items that we found. We found a cool... It was a... What was it called? I'll find it. We found this, the Stora Greatsword, not the, not the small one. Oh, we found the Executioner's Greatsword, which is pretty neat. The weight, though, is a bit awful. 
How much does my battle axe weigh? Four pounds? See, that's why it's so quick. It's only four pounds heavy. This one's nine pounds to be like, so slow. Jeez. The Cuphead soundtrack? Oh, man, Turk. I like, oh, man, that game in general is awesome. The art style? Oh, fantastic. 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 Mr. Gon says, yep, trying to stream it. The Cuphead. Might not like my language. Ah, it's all good, Mr. G. No, I like it when people curse. I think it's hilarious. <laughs> Dropped a couple of, oh, snaps. Turk's Cup, or Turk's Cup. Turk's Cup is his new love. No. Cuphead is Turk's new love. Uh -uh. I know, I saw your scores, Turk. Pretty awesome. Beating them levels. Oh, I know, I'm sorry, Dome. Because I watch the stream more, but it's always really late. Well, thank you for coming in tonight. I'm sorry about that. I know. Sometimes it's late for me, too. Oh, I knew it. I knew this guy transformed into something weird. Oh, he's just a suicider. Well, that was strange. Can we get some panic baskets in the chat for that guy? That was just weird. Turned into a fire creature. He lunged at us, and that was it. He died. <laughs> Unless he, like... I don't know, impaled himself on a pike or something. That was weird. Now, see, I don't know if I would play Cuphead, though. Those games are hard. Those games are, like, literally hard. Those, I don't think I'd have a chance. Because I don't think you're able to level up in Cuphead, are you? I think the only reason I'm doing well in Dark Souls, honestly, you guys, is because I'm grinding it. I think I'm way overpowered for where I'm supposed to be. Oh, all these guys commit suicide. What do you know? Free souls for us. Then we just keep walking. Like, all right, just another day here in Dark Souls. But I don't know. Now, that is a good question, though. I don't know if I would stream Cuphead. I guess I'd have to watch a couple of you guys stream it, see what you know, your reactions and stuff are. Because that one, if I can't play it, you know, if I can't win at all, oh, I would be sad. Dark Souls, I learned that you just got to start leveling up. You know? Don't stay behind. Keep going through the levels over and over. It's a lot of repetition. Yeah, it does, Mr. Gonzo. Incredible artwork indeed. The soundtrack, like Turk said, is amazing. I've been watching you until the third stream it. Um, who else streamed Cuphead? Boogie streamed it. Craig streamed a little bit of it. Um, almost all my favorite casters. Except for the ones that are usually, you know, on their first person shooters. Oh, uh, gross. I finally got to see this guy's vomit. It's all full of maggots and whatnot. Oh, sorry, I thought somebody opened my door. Oh, by the way, you guys, my mom's not feeling good. She's under the weather, so she didn't go to work today. Sucks, you guys. I hope she gets better, though, soon. I think she had what I had that that last week. She, uh, she threw up in the bath, so I feel bad, man. Feels bad for mom. Oh, I know, right? Those uh, those old complaints that they had. Oh, here we go. We found the new area. Oh, jeez. Yeah, those old complaints that they had when the, uh, the we used to have the straps or they didn't have the right type of strap. I still have one of those old first-gen controllers. Not the ones that didn't have the strap, but the ones that had the different kind of strap where it didn't lock. Ah, oh, jeez. I thought this guy was dead. No, now he's dead. Now he's dead. Oh, Jibus H. Yeah. All right, man, so much slime. All I hear is a bunch of like wet, nasty mess going on. Ah, oh, I got some blood loss going on too now. Ugh. Okay, let's chug a lug. I wasn't watching my health there. That was not good. Could have died. Could have died. And Dose Lionheart, welcome to the channel. Thank you for the host, Dose Lionheart, bringing all your viewers in. Welcome to the stream. Guys, Dose was streaming the other day. Uh, let's throw him the fellowship hype real quick, my friend. Dose Lionheart, he was playing some uh, Oblivion. But uh, today, I think he was playing some Halo something or other. But on that last cast, he was playing some Oblivion. Oh, uh, that is not your shield full escape, you crazy buffoon. Okay, there we are. My apologies, escapees. 
I had to go ham on her because other otherwise she would have taken me out. My health was low. I was either go ham or stay in that corner stuck and take a lot of damage and whatnot. Oh, sorry about that. There we go. <laughs> What's rage comps? I know, babe. Thank you. I hope she feels better too. I've just been telling her mom drink a lot of that sprite that you have in the bathroom or in the bathroom. What the heck? Sprite that you have in the refrigerator. And stay close to the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, drink that sprite you have in the bathroom over there. Now everybody knows where I keep my sprite. Dang it. Just trying to save it so nobody else would drink it, but I guess we can't do that now. I gotta share. Alright, I'm going up. There's an option to go right over there, so I'm just gonna check it out. Let's see. Oh no, let's go right. Cause look, there's an item down there. Yeah, let's go. Man, what a confusing area, you guys. I'll be completely honest. I have no idea where I'm going. We're just going until we find something good. Which there are two good things right there. Oh, hold on, let's get rid of these crazy people. It looks strange. And this guy's completely nonchalant about it, so we'll attack him if we can. Something blew up back there, but I'm not gonna look at it. Ignorance is bliss, right, escapees? Oh! Is it the giant? Another giant? A different one? Somebody's throwing arrows again. Oh man, don't tell me there's another giant we had to befriend. Or unfriend. If it goes that way, I guess. Ooh, an undead bone shard! Yes, you guys! Found another bone shard. We can upgrade our Estuses. That means they'll heal us for more. Oh, I love it. Good, good. Okay, I'll take a repair powder. Young white branch. I think that's a peace branch. Soul of an unknown traveler. I'll take that as well. Oh, jeez, that guy grew his stomach too. Oh. Oh, I'm pointed backwards, that's my own fault. That's my own fault. <laughs> These guys have butt cracks. I don't know why I just noticed. Look at their butt though. Oh, you didn't get to see it. It's like two flat pancakes back there. Hey, what is going on with that shadow? Oh well, ignore it. Okay, um, we're a little bit damaged, so let's go ahead and heal up. We shall heal up. I know, right, Trig? You know you're in the right area when tons of enemies appear. True that. True that. And I haven't said it for a while, you guys, so happy Wednesday slash Thursday, depending on what area you're at. It is 10.58 p.m. Pacific Standard over here. Oh man, what did I do now? Large soul of an unknown traveler again. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, well, he fell down. That counts, too. Okay, well, I hope the giant doesn't start throwing stuff at us, but... Oh, jeez! You know it probably will. You know it probably will. Okay, let's continue, I guess, downward. Or no, didn't I come from that area? I think I went this way and up around. Okay, yeah, let's go. Nothing more to see down here. I think we can continue up this way, though. That way, or tops. Let's go tops. Oh, jeez. That freaking sound scares me every time. Oh, we going to that cathedral, too. Hold on here. I don't know what that is. It just looks like a fire inside there. Could be anything, though. Too bad we can't zoom in with the, uh, the binoculars. That'd be cool. All right, at least we got a couple items here. Oh no, a door. Anytime I see a giant door, it's always a little bit scary. There's no, uh, nobody left any verbal warnings though, so fingers crossed that it'll be okay. Let me see here. An ambush, oh great. I'm not ready for an ambush, that's for sure. Heal up real quick. 2 a.m., so sorry, oh man. Well, I am so sorry that I do stream very, very late. We had Dome saying that not able to catch some of the cast because I stream kind of late and uh, I'm still working on my schedule you guys oh red bug pellet nice 
Still working on my schedule escapees. So I do apologize, you know, if I do stream a little bit late. But uh, I gotta be honest, you guys, work has been a bit stressful lately. Oh jeez, alright. Ah, there it is. There you are. Oh! Oh no no no, it's one of those... One of those suiciders! Lock onto this person over here. Try to get them with a firebomb or something. Some throwing knives. Oh, jeez. Well, that's not gonna work. Mm, I have a crossbow that I could use, but I don't really want to waste it either at the same time. Hmm. So we can go this way and go up that way, or I'm thinking maybe we'll go back. Let's go to that little cathedral on the edge. I don't want to go too far out. Far out of the way. Especially when there might be something interesting over here. Or another dead end, you never know. <laughs> Take care of that guy just in case. Alright, looks good. Yes, I did! So sorry! Yep, we've killed them and we've killed them multiple times now, thank goodness. Those dang crabs, yeah, they're not too bad anymore. But before, oh, they were awful. <laughs> Try finger, but hold. Ooh, curse word, great shield. Let me see that shield. I like shields. I'm a shield person. I'm more of a big shield person, but still, little shields are okay. Ooh, it blocks 100% of physical damage. That's what I enjoy. A little bit weaker, but that's okay. Everything else is better. Look at that defense on magic. Mine's only at 59. That one's at 75. Lightning defense, for some reason, is a little bit weaker, but... Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Hmm, this is actually a way better shield. For some reason, it's super heavy, though. Look at that. 17 pounds. This one's only 6, and it's a lot longer. I would use this War God wooden shield, but it only does about 84 defense against that physical damage, too. This is the second one that I really enjoy, but once again, only 84 defense. We've got some cool shields, though. All right, continuing onward. Let me touch the tablet real quick, escapees. Crab killing machine now. Yes, yeah, now I got my revenge. I hate those crabs. They give us the solid 800 souls though if you kill them. So I'll admit, sometimes I do. Sometimes I do farm them. Uh oh, have people jumped here and they, you know, not made it? Oops. Kick ladder. No, don't kick the ladder. How do I? Uh, how do I climb down the ladder? I don't know. I guess let's kick the ladder. Oh, there we go. Okay. You had to kick it so that it goes all the way down. All right, I see. I was like, I don't want to get rid of the ladder. No. Oh, that's a long distance down. Uh oh. Okay, just making sure that looked creepy. Guys, let me know if anything uh, is wrong with the headset. Uh oh. What's this? Hey, never mind, I don't want to know who it is. Forget I asked. It was a stupid question. It's all that vomit that these damn zombie skeletons have been throwing up lately. There we go. That wasn't too bad. How many souls do we get for that? That little kill right there. Oh, I didn't see something. There's about a hundred souls or so. And cool down too much. Oh, man. Stability rating of a shield is very important. Stability rating, let's check that out. See, I'm still new to the game, you guys, so I don't know some of these mechanics. Sometimes stability. What does that affect, uh, Gary? Just curious. What does stability affect, escapees? Is that your, like, your stance? Oh, jeez, hold on. Oh, blood loss. I must have been standing in a, uh, a not so good area. Or I must be standing right now in a not so good area. We're the herald, so we're, we're able to level up, thank goodness. Or not level up, uh, heal up. 
All right, what is this guy protecting? He's got to be protecting something down here. I see one item. Ooh, Saint Tree Belvine. Cool. Oh, I was too slow on that roll. Slow your roll, soul escape. Don't slow it that much. Oh, too slow on that roll, too. Cool. Alright, looks good, looks good. Not bad. Oh, it's because I that's my own fault. I'm in that nasty water that's causing this strange bleeding effect to happen. Oh, let's go kill this my best friend right here. Dang it. Come back here. Drop me something good. Twinkle tide at night again. That blood loss, you guys, that blood loss. I don't know how to get rid of it. We're just gonna have to die. That's the only course of action is to pass away. Oh no! We gotta use our Estus, you guys. I don't have any regular uh, Herald type healing items anymore. Alright. Oh, another twinkling titan. <gasps> oh my god, I know who this person is! We meet one of these characters in the beginning of the game, and uh, yep, not good. Esmeoft, I don't have a torch. Is that what the torches are for? Oh gosh. So more stability, it has less stamina required for blocking. Oh, okay, Gary, that's what it was. <gasps> it was probably those leeches. Okay, I see. Remember how I said they throw maggots at you when those uh, creatures vomit? It, it was probably leeches instead, those bigger ones. Gross, thank you, Esmeoft. I'll have to remember that. I actually don't have a torch, dang it. I remember you. Oh, he was a lot smaller back then. Or maybe he wasn't, you never know. Oh! Oh, come on, Soul. You were, like, right next to him. How could you do that? <laughs> Roll after the fact, nice. Ooh, big old tail swipe. See if you can roll back. My heart's beating, I'm scared. My heart's beeping. I'm gonna use my last Estus. Woo! Should we cheat and use the firebomb? Maybe, huh? Ooh, finally. Titanite scale. Scale is good. <laughs> Be wary of lizard, thank you. Alright, uh, I think it's time for us to go level up, my friends. I think it's definitely time for us to go level up. We need to get out of here. I have no Estus. Oh gosh, what did I do? I have no Estus. I have no health, nothing. Alright, my friends. Okay, let's go back. We're going to backtrack our steps. We could use a uh, one of those bones. Those uh, homeward bones. Let's use the homeward bone. I haven't used one in quite a while. Actually, I haven't used one ever, so let's go ahead and use one. Homeward Bone, that's an item I do have. <laughs> one of them. Alright, and I don't think we lose any of our souls if we use this one. I think that's only if we have the Ring of Sacrifice or something. Alright, uh... Let's go to the bonfire that we last rested at. That's fine. That's fine. Hey, Clappy, good to see you. And we got little yellow submarines in the channel. How are you doing? Yeah, this is my first time in a Dark Souls game ever. Uh, so we're just doing our best and stuff. Trying to learn. I'm level 54, I believe, now. 
And uh, thank you for coming in, escapees. Wow, it was a pretty chill night. And uh, all of a sudden we have a whole bunch of friends here in the channel. If you're enjoying the cast, please consider hitting that follow button, you guys. That would help out the stream a lot. Uh, but if you can't, you know, for any reason, that's okay too. Thank you for, you know, just coming in, giving us a little bit of company, you guys, and uh, sharing your knowledge about the game. That's cool. Without giving, you know, too many hints or backseating or anything like that. Um, if you want to join us on any of the other social media sites, we have Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, all that good stuff. That is soul underscore escape, S-O-U-L underscore 3-S-C-4-P-3. Now I am going to go back to the shrine. And we're going to level up a little bit. Now, I made the mistake of leveling with Yol, so my character looks like a zombie now. Oops. She's even more hideous than before. No. Thank you for the follow, guys. Can we throw a new follower hype in the cast? Real quick, I believe we're at, as long as nobody has unfollowed in the last minute, which that does happen, we should be at 7,200 still. <laughs> I know, right? They're all encouraged, little, all of that's encouraged. In fact, if you don't spoil or backseat, you know, you might as well just, what are you doing? You might as well just watch something else. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. No, I'm, I'm pretty cool. The only thing is... I Welcome do get a little bit upset when people are like, so you need to do this, or you gotta do this, or you have to do that. I'm like, well, I don't think we have to, but it might Very be suggested. Well. But now we're pretty cool here in the stream, you guys. All right, let's take, take some nourishment. nourishment from these sovereignless souls. Lots of nourishment. Okay, so I honestly, we last uh, leveled up. What did we level up? It was Vitality, huh? I have, this is my first character, she's a herald, level 54, going on to level 55. But, uh, and we are kind of hollowed right now, unfortunately. Oops, I've been taking those free levels, free levels from Yol. I didn't know it was going to turn me into a nasty old hollowed. Otherwise, maybe I wouldn't have done it, but keyword maybe, right? Okay, so like I said, we, my character's kind of everywhere. She is a herald, but she doesn't really have that many faith points and stuff. I kind of use that healing as kind of like a backseat help when you know during the downtime and stuff. I have a lot of escapees telling me that I should be going for more uh, dexterity so we can hold those cool weapons. Turk, thank you for everything. Thank you for being here. Have a great night, Turk. And hello, Mezzer. I see you in there. Much love to you, Mez. And uh, Turk, thank you for everything. Have a great night. Ever onward, ever forward to bed. And I hope to see you on Snapchat again. Have a good night, Turk. Guys, let's get a hype for Turk. He's one of our, one of our longest running mods here in the channel. Do Stanley being the other one. This is Xbox, uh, little, this is the Xbox. Here's my gamer tag if you want. My gamer tag. Blind run indeed. Go Blue LA is still in here. Go Blue LA, one of our longest running mods too. Thank you, Mezzer. Much love, escapees. Thank you for hanging out with us. You guys rock, I appreciate it. All right, uh, yeah, we're gonna go with a little bit more dexterity this time around. I do like that vitality though. Look what it does to our defense. Plus two on the defense, isn't that amazing? I love it. The strength too is addicting to level up. I have like a strange little tank herald over here. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go with dexterity a bit. All those souls. At least they're being put to good use though, right? And I think we got a, uh, oh, sorry, sorry, fire keeper. I think we have a shard that we can burn. Yes, we do. Yay, you guys, our Estus is gonna heal us a little bit more. Woo, hype on that, you guys, excellent. Got that bone shard. Nice, nice. Oh, I could really use a beer right now. This is Clappy, what happened, Clap? Just been so fed up with all this BS and short days, shorty days you've been having. What kind of shorty days, Clappy? Shorty days at school? Oh, I, I'm guessing you meant like crappy days. I'm sorry about that, Clappy. Yeah, we have an Estes shard too. Oh yeah, that's right. Thank you, Gary. True that, my friend. That means we gotta pay our beloved. I like how the firekeeper changes her spot every now and then. She's not always standing in the same area. Yes, we ah, must talk to well, our uh, elder over here. It's good to see ye in good health. What and needs thank you, my man. Place? My Estus is actually. Oops. There we are. Yes, please. Cool, you guys. All right. Um. Yeah, let's go seven two. <laughs> well. Yeah, we'll go seven two. Cause I, the only thing I use my magic for 
It's for healing, so we'll just go with straight up healing. Yes, we'll go with that. Good. Pretty cool. Man, careful. we're upgraded, you guys. I don't want we to are see upgraded. My squandered. No, I feel you, man. I feel you. Okay, and I don't think I can upgrade any ah, my weapons well, just yet. It is good to see ye in good health. What Deuce needs Stanley with the host. Day. Thank you, Deuce. Um. No, not the weapon. Soul. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. I was going to say, oh, all right. Sorry, I thought shield had a different category, like reinforced defense. But no, no. Still under weapon. You just got to go over here. So I've already been reinforcing uh, my Lothric Knight shield. And this is the one that I kind of rely on. But we found this one lately, and it's really, really cool. Although it does require a strength of 34 to wield, so my strength is nowhere near 34, unfortunately. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet, full. And I think it's probably my fault. I've been kind of putting my skill points like everywhere. It's not just set in like straight up strength or straight up defense or anything. So let's just uh, keep upgrading our slightly less cool weapons. How many of those do I need? Six of them? I have 23? Okay. Now I'm starting to need the large titanite shards and I don't know where to find those. Not yet. Alright, so that's upgraded Pretty to the max. Be careful. I don't want to see my work squandered. <laughs> All right, let's talk to him. We have defeated a mini ah, boss. Tis good to what needs? See, sometimes he'll give you some stuff. Ah, oh, now nah, he's just gonna tell us the spiel. Just gonna tell us the spiel again. Stranger Things season two. You that is a series that Oceanic wanted me to start watching. Man, I miss Oceanic, you guys. Mod in the cast. But should chance impel them break, bring them me. I'll Thank you, sir. Yes. <laughs> I haven't uh, had to use a repair powder just yet, luckily. Mm, I know I have a lot to sell, but I think we'll be fine now. For the moment, huh, Firekeeper? He think we'll be all right, right? She, like, mm, shrugs. I don't know. I see a lot of you people. All right. Let's travel. Um... We were in the Cathedral of the Deep. Let's go into the Cleansing Chapel again. We'll see. This is a weird maze area. So I'm, I'm like I said, my first playthrough of Dark Souls 3, my first playthrough of any Dark Souls game. So I'm just kind of going with the flow, seeing where we find enemies and whatnot. Hopefully, you know, things are all good. But uh, yeah, you guys, thank you for hanging out. We used to, or we like to do this during the loading screen. If you're enjoying the cast, please consider hitting that follow button for us here in the Soul Stream. Become an escapee today, you guys. And Subtober. Uh, excuse me, September has now been extended to September. So any Twitch affiliate or any uh, partner caster that you've been wanting to sub to, now would be a good time, you guys, to show them some love because subs are only half off right now, half priced. Here's a couple of those links in the channel. And if you want to help us out in the cast by retweeting, oh man, that would be amazing, you guys. Retweeting or following on Instagram, all of those help out a little bit, escapees. Actually, more than you know. All right, as I'll go back. I'll go back real quick. I didn't see that. Because people have been telling me that you need to buy a torch for some reason. Hopefully it's a reasonable price. Hopefully. You're stuck on a cliffhanger. Oh man, clap you. I know, I, I know a lot of you guys probably don't uh, watch this show, but I'm excited for Vikings season, I believe it's on season five or season six already. But yeah, very, very, very good show, you guys. It's on History Channel. Oh, I was going to do the Snapchat one. No, that's okay. Yeah, right, Mr. Gonzo? The wait between seasons. But hey, they got to film it, right? Doesn't come out of thin air, now does it, Mr. Gonzo? He's all impatient. He's like, I know that. Okay. Um, I'm assuming that the handmaid has well, the torch. One. But you know what happens when I you assume. Oh, I'm sorry, Clappy. Oh yeah, there we go. We can give her the ash as well. Gracious. Yes. Passing fine ash thou hast given. Yes, indeed. Take yes, it. Take it all. Nourishment. I nourishment only hope these new wares content thee. <laughs> oh, I'm contented with your old wares, my friend. Old wares hype. <laughs> Half price, I know, Ray Blue. Half price, Kappa. Well, I know, poor Blue. I don't know what happened to your sub. It should have been, though, I swear in my soul. It says if you're a first-time sub for any affiliate or partner caster, it should have been half off. Promise. That's at least what it said on the article. 
I don't know why it wasn't like that though. That's sad. Very sad. Alright, skeepies, let's see here. Hmm. Got some ember. What else did she have? Oh, the purple moss clump. This helps us with the poison buildup. Blooming purple moss clump. Probably a better version of the regular one, I'm assuming. Charcoal pine. Ooh. That's kind of cool. Homeward bone. She's got a lot of those. Dried finger. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I should start saving up for this tower key just to see what that's all about. We should, we should. Fair and dart. Cool. She's starting to sell some spells. And a healing aid. Nice. Crescent axe. Now that is cool. Only six weight. Dude, I could... I could use that. Oh, it's a halberd, though. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Sage's big hat. The hat that I was talking about. Although maybe that's the Crystal Sage's big hat. 10,000 souls. Okay, here's the torch. There we go. All right, I'll take the torch. I'm not sure how to use it, but we're gonna take a torch. Supposedly it helps us out, so. Be sure I'm gonna trust you, escapees. All right, be sure not to lose your soul, all right? Bye, handmaiden. I call her the handmaiden. I think she's just the handmaid. <laughs> Don't ask me why. She looks like a young lady, all right? Okay, let's travel. We're going back to the cleansing chapel. And uh, we'll just walk our way through that maze over there. Blue got half off, he said. Go blue LA, that is. Seem Gary says it's a great show with a uh, nice story and some nice actors. Oh, Stranger Things. I was watching Stranger Things. Is that that one with that little girl? Yes, okay. Yeah, true that. I was watching some Stranger Things. So don't spoil it, you guys. No. Um, yeah, I did start watching that on Netflix for a little bit. And then, unfortunately, though, I fell off. I started watching some different movies and stuff. Going back to anime, I was fighting between whether I should watch a real series or watch, watch some anime and stuff because I'm still working on Berserk. But, uh, yeah, I did, actually. That's right. No wonder it sounded so familiar. That was the uh, that was the show that Oceanic had suggested for us to watch, you guys. I know, right, Blue? Next month, five bucks. It goes back to being expensive. All right, Bay. Bay's got to go to the bathroom, you guys. So she's on BRB. She's on that BRB. All right, escapees. Let me drop some soul gems in the chat for you. Soul gems are just the currency here in the channel. Oh, Stranger Things, yes. I mean, Vikings, yes, Gary. Yes, I love uh, Vikings, indeed. I was sad after you know what happened, but... I don't, you know, I think the show will be amazing still, regardless. Regardless. Rosario Vampire, that's interesting. Is that one on Netflix as well? Here's one of the suiciders. Take him out before he decides to charge at us. All willy nilly. I think if we want to level up again, it's going to cost... Uh, not 18,000 this time, I think it's about... Almost 19,000 souls, so we better start collecting, huh? Whoop! These guys like to charge at you. And then they just die. <laughs> Alright. Whatever you say, strange bodies. Uh oh. Oh, there is another pathway over here. Let's check this out. Oh yeah, it's that strange overhang. I'm gonna try it since we're so close to the... Uh, the bonfire, let's just check it out. Oh, it's kind of like a shortcut to this weird area. Hmm. Okay. Mocha? Who's drinking mocha right now? Share, please. I need a little bit of caffeine to stay up myself. Oh, that was too far away, darn it. These guys, when they cough at you, I think they cough their maggots. They cough maggots at you. All right, there you go. Now somehow the torch is supposed to help us out. Help, torch, help. All right, let's see if I can equip it or something. I don't know how the torch is going to help us with the bleeding damage, but we'll see. Um, cool, it is reducing it. Aw, oh, thank you for that tip. It's 
reducing it fairly quickly, so that's good. I don't know if I have to swing it around or anything. <laughs> away! Away, foul creatures! Away! Can we light sconces with it? <laughs> Put out our own torch in the water. Oh, that's not a very smart soul. Okay, am I over encumbered? Oh, I am. If I have that equipped there, I'm over encumbered by about 1%. Okay, let's go into the second area over here. Uh-oh. Alright. Take that torch back out. So I'm gonna heal up since we're uh, a little bit damaged there. Hey Minnesota, how are you doing? Long time no see. Got another educator in the room, Minnesota. Welcome to the channel. How's school been going, man? I've been a bit tired, I gotta be honest. I was telling the cast earlier, man, school's been stressful. We had the uh, the state fair, Central Washington State Fair, recently, and I know a lot of the kids went because it was a little bit closer. And uh, oh man, they've been hyper. They have not been wanting to do their work. I had to call the principal today. I hate doing that, you guys. I'm always like, man, you make me call the principal. Oh. Because, you know, I don't want to get anybody in trouble for something that, you know, shouldn't be that big of a deal. All right, there we are. And on yesterday's cast escapees, we ended up killing the Crystal Sage. So we did take out the Crystal Sage. And uh, now we're just in the area kind of behind the Crystal Sage's working space, what have you. Alright, if, if we reach that bleeding point, it does take away a big old chunk of our health, so best not to do that. Best not to tempt the fates, my friends. Alright, now I remember if we go through this way, we meet up with that ice dude. Oh, you too? Esmu, nice! Teaching a fifth grade class? Oh man, that's amazing. I have third graders. I got, um, this year I have first, second, and third grade. Last year I had fourth grade. Oh, I do have a little bit of fourth graders. Last year I had mostly fourth grade, fifth grade, and first graders. But uh, yeah, I teach special classes though. The ones where the kids need a little bit of extra help. Specialty classes. We're in the same state! Nice! California! Same with Phaedra! Phaedra in that state as well! Dang, CM Gary, you are hoarding up those souls, or those gems fast. Alright, escapees. Oh, three educators in the room! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, you know things are gonna get... Things are gonna get pretty teachy up in here. There we are. No, we were talking about teaching the other day in Dos Lionheart's channel. He's like, oh, that must be so much fun. I was like, yeah, fun, Kappa. No, I do enjoy it, though, in all honesty. I like teaching and stuff. But, uh, oh, man, sometimes I feel it's as though it's a lot of um, a lot of teaching of manners that I think should be happening at home. I don't want to do all that parenting that I feel like we have to do in the schools nowadays. Like, man, why do I got to teach your kid to share? Why can't you guys do it? <laughs> so mean. By you guys, I just mean the parents. Why can't the parents do it? They probably do, though. Minnesota's rocking that 10th grade, those sophomores. Oh, man, I can't even imagine. Now, high school kids, I would not, I don't know how I'd uh, be able to teach them because I'm so short. I'm only five foot two. So uh, some of the fifth graders are actually getting a little bit taller than me. Well, the fourth graders actually um, beat me in height. My fourth graders from last year, they're like, Miss Escape, you're so small. I'm like, oh, thank you. And at the same time, I'm like, Whoa, when tear shuts down. When tear shuts down. We found a titanite shard up there. Let's see what's back over here on this lovely hill. And this back area has yet to be explored too. Man, there's a lot of areas. Oh look, here's that one. I think, isn't this close to the bonfire? I think this is the bonfire room, huh? 
Oh, it's another Titanite shard. Hmm. Okay. Oh yeah, this is, because that's that ledge where I said, look, there's a ledge up there. And then those guys that commit suicide, they jump out at you. Mm-hmm, there it is. Oh, cool. Hmm. Apparently this goes into a little side room over here. There's nothing in it, though. Oh! Besides that ladder. Mm, I remember this area. Cool. Alright, so last time we went this way and there's a whole bunch of those enemies. What if we go back this way, though? Oh, at least to a dead end? Alright. Well, at least we know. At least we know. <laughs> True greatness does not come from your body height. So whether you're vertically challenged or not, Still be an amazing person. No. no, I agree with you, uh, CM Gary. I agree for sure. I just feel personally probably a little bit intimidated by the kids. I'm not a very like super harsh teacher or anything. I'm not very stern. So I can only imagine having the high schoolers. They probably walk all over me. <laughs> Miss Escape, do this. No. Ah. All right. Made it to a different area. It looks like. So far, I only see that guy, but you never know around the corner somebody's bound to pop out. Ooh. I hate this guy. He starts to, uh, see, he causes that strange bleeding damage to the curse. There, okay. <gasps> Ooh, poison bite ring. I'm assuming that ring helps you against poison. Alright, let's get our lovely torch back out. I don't know how the torch helps you out with this, but it does somehow. <laughs> it does. Must burn off all those leeches and whatnot. Blue says, I'm real with kids too. They ask for drinks and snacks. Oh man. Drinks and snacks. They're always hungry. True that. A lot of my, uh, a lot of my students, like right before lunch and stuff, they'll be like, is it almost lunch yet? I'm like, yes, I told you it's like in half an hour. Half an hour. Esmu says he's in Silicon Valley. Nice. And true that, CM. True that. Welcome back, Bedra. Welcome back. Bedra's in San Diego. We were talking about California for a little bit, Bay. Um, Esmu is from there. A teacher. Oh, let me touch the tablet. There we go. That's just what I used to communicate with the stream. Okay, so that was the narrow pathway right here. I guess that doesn't lead too far in. Hmm. So I'm gonna assume I'm gonna call it good there. I'm gonna call it good that we explored that area, we killed this guy. Is there anything behind him? Back in this area? No, not too much. Nothing. Okay, I'm gonna call it good, escapees. I'm gonna say that we got this area cleared through. But, uh, no, we're not leaving the cast yet, not till midnight. But we can go back through here. And save up the bonfire again, just for, I guess, just for fun. Because we can't open any of these doors just yet. Alright. So we're gonna have to look for some different areas to explore. Which I can tell that there's going to be a lot in this strange cemetery looking place. Ooh, who's got some tamales? Oh, Bay? What? Nah, it's not close enough to winter. None of us have tamales yet. We're talking about blue. We're talking about blue. No, I always thought it was cool. Well, my family was pretty weird. We only made, we're Hispanic. We only made tamales like during winter time and Christmas. So whenever somebody else had tamales like around March or something, I'm always like, man, they're celebrating a little bit early. <laughs> I always thought that tamales were straight up Christmas food. Everybody's like, no, you can make them any time you want. Oh, okay. There's no tamale etiquette that we gotta follow. <laughs> Almost rolled into him. Right, there we go. Your tamales, Blue! It's not Christmas yet. Scream. Bay was born near Silicon Valley. Nice. <laughs> Opens mouth for a taco. 
Oh man, just like a baby bird. Just like a cute little baby bird, Blue. Somebody feed that man. Mocha for sure, ooh. Ooh, mocha. Chocolate. All right, so if we go through here, we end up in that back area. Hmm. Oh, we can roll down. Let's roll down this area. Just curious. Just want to see. Watch. Oh, I think he got me first. Okay. Yeah, there's that dude. There's somebody up here. Here's that bridge that we finally come to. Oh, one last hit. Oops. It's always that last secretive hit that I miss. Okay, just making sure. I heard a lot of voices there. Oh, okay, I knew it. I was like, I heard a lot of voices. It sounded like somebody was behind us. And lo and behold, there was. Right there. Oh great, let's get out of here. Lots of zombies. Or undead, I guess we should call them. All right, I cleared out that bottom area. There's just a couple items, some cool items, an Estus shard, and one of those uh, bones that you can burn also. Who's that? Oh, somebody fancy over here. Oh, the blood loss. Ugh. Oh man, let's hopefully they gave they gave us those twin knives. That's cool. Oh, a regular titanite shard. Corn sarn it. Okay, let's chill for a second here, Scapey. I think the blood loss is still coming on. Not good. Mostly Pepsi. Ooh, did we ask Coker Pepsi? Face it. So I was gonna say earlier. Drinking Sprite while you're sick is so Mexican, <laughs> but it works. Dude, that's exactly what my mom said when uh, when my stomach wasn't feeling so good. She's like, drink some Sprite. And so now that her stomach's not feeling too good either, I'm like, mom, drink that Sprite. You know you want it. That's a good question, Gary. I don't know if the fires in Yosemite are still burning, but I know that Washington had some nasty old fires recently. It was awful, you guys. California is really nice, is Gary. We were kind of disappointed from LA and San Francisco, but Yosemite and the landscape in general were really, really nice. I barely made my first trip to California this summer. So I feel you. I feel you, Gary. I thought it was beautiful, beautiful landscape. Amazing place. It reminded me a lot of Washington. So it felt like home. The only thing is I knew it was really, really far away from home. In my brain, I knew. In my brain, I knew it. Okay, so we've been down that area. I think we kind of cleared it out too. So it is time to go and explore this top weird, this top weird area, I think. Yeah, the big doors, yep, yep. It is time to go through that big door. Let's check it out, let's see. Always, always a creepy feeling going through those big doors. Goodness. Oh yeah, we can go this way. Let's go sideways. Oh, that's right. We can go through this way. Yep, I remember. There's like a strange, uh... Oh, jeez. There was a strange route that you could take that led through a couple of uh, rooftops and whatnot. Let's go see. Ooh. Secret item, a rusted coin. What does that do? Maybe it's not an equipment, though. It could be in just regular inventory stuff. Oh, we have two. Crush to temporarily boost item discovery. Interesting. Kind of cool. Kind of cool, you guys. But yeah, you gotta love those Hispanic Mexican superstitions. <laughs> Shame on you, says Blue. Oh, gosh. Oh, mostly Pepsi. Oh, that's where the Pepsi came from, Blue. Oh, you drink Pepsi instead? My mom always said it was the clear sodas that would help you out like stomach problems or just not feeling good in general, the flu, any sort of sickness, to go drink some 7-Up. Oh 
Alright. Okay, let's try opening the, these uh, big doors over here. Or, no, 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 not yet, not yet. I'm scared. Let's go through this area real quick. Real quick, escapees. My best friend over here. <sighs> that flame buddy. Oh, flame buddy killed another flame buddy. Oh, thought he would die after those two hits. Hey, you have an Estus. Let me have that Estus bottle. You don't need it. That feeling when the enemy has an Estus and you don't. Oh gosh, I almost fell off. Mm. Be wary of the right, okay. Oh, you mean right now? Oh, right now. Be wary of the right, right now. Right, that just looks like a creepy place to fall off. What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> that sling blade. Oh, oh, wonderful sling blade. <laughs> I almost rolled off the edge. Dang it, guys! Thank you for hanging out with me, though. I do appreciate it, and I hope you're having a good uh, Thursday by now. Hope you're having a good Thursday. Or Wednesday, if you're still on Wednesday. I'm still on Wednesday. For another uh, 18 minutes, it looks like. Oh, sorry. <gasps> I didn't know somebody was coming up. Oh, got me good. Got me. More crawling up? No? Nobody else crawling up up here? My mom super yelled at me when I'm sick and not wearing socks in the house. That's why you're sick. Or if you go outside with like wet hair, that's why you're sick. You went outside with your hair all wet. Of course you were gonna catch a cold. No. Oh gosh. No, I feel you. Or don't point at the rainbow because you get a wart on your finger. Oh, I gotta love those superstitions, you guys. Or if you see a black cat crossing in front of you, you gotta make the sign of the cross on your windshield. Oh, I guess I'll take out the, the sword dude first. If I can take any of them out at all, that is. I think they got me. Oh, come on. Alright, I'm getting too greedy here. Want to go for a quick kill? It's not going to happen that way. It's going to be a slow kill if any kill at all. <laughs> That's like me with my heavy items. I can barely wield them. I'm like... Burn. Okay, um... Yeah, we'll stay with the regular healing. Oh, we upgraded our Estus finally. We burned one of those undead bones. And uh, now we can heal up a little bit better. Yay! Better healing hype. Two guys. Crossbow action. Three guys with crossbow action. Hurry. Oh, darn it. I know somebody's behind me, I don't know who it is though. There you are. Oh! I always think that I kill this guy in two hits. There's always a third sneaky hit that I forget. Alright, oh, an item. Oh, <gasps> an Arabalist. Or Arbalest, an Arbalest. I read that dyslexically. Okay, leave that guy alone. He looks a little bit scary. He looks a little bit scary down there. Yes! Brother is here! Hey, Okami! Welcome to the channel. Welcome back, I should say. Dang it! Sorry, you had to see me die. Oh, I thought I was gonna die right there. So close. Very close. I just ended up hacking and slashing. I'm like, well, whatever happens, happens. We're here now. Oh, no, 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 no. They're praying to that lady right there. One of those big ladies that prays and throws magic at you. <laughs> the rainbow and the wart one? Yes. They're like, don't wear, or don't, uh, and also don't look at a rainbow, or don't look at the eclipse, 
if you're pregnant, and if you do, you have to wear like a safety pin. That's another weird superstition that I grew up with. Kami, welcome to the channel. How are you tonight? Thank you for hanging out. You guys are awesome. I appreciate it. Uh, once again, if you're enjoying the cast, please consider hitting the follow button. I just threw down some links in the channel for Facebook, uh, Instagram, any of those social sites if you want to hang out with us. We got a Discord channel also. My gamer tag is there. And uh, yeah, always, if you guys can, please feel free to re, re I can't even say it, we tweet, <laughs> retweet the stream. Uh, that helps a lot, you guys. It helps a ton. Especially since I don't have a lot of uh, followers on the Twitter. Udison Gamer, welcome to the channel. How are you doing, Udison? And Underlinked is here too. How are you doing, Underlinked? Welcome to the channel. Gonna lurk? All right. Lurk away, my friends. No, I feel you. I lurk in a lot of cast myself. Man, Clappy, don't say that, Clappy. Sometimes I don't want to go to work myself, but you know what? I have to. Who else gonna teach? Oh god, I died. Oh no. And that final laugh was the last thing I heard. Oh, oh, oh gosh, you guys. Rip. Rip in pieces. Oh. Thank you for the follow, you just said. I'm sorry you guys had to witness that. Rest in peace there, Skippies. There goes all my 10,000 souls now. We have one chance to get them back, though. One chance. One ring to find them all. Eighth grade, Clappy. No, but school is good for you, you know. They're just trying to help you learn. So you can do whatever you want to be when you grow up. At least you'll have some options that way. Which is a good thing. It's always good to have options, right, escapees? <laughs> Mr. Gonzo called it! You knew I was gonna fall off? Dang it. Dang it, Mr. G. Oh. Let's see, what did Mr. G say something in the chat that I missed? You was gonna fall off the edge, how dare you. How dare you, Mr. Gonzo? Pull out your inner Miss Cleo. And know what was gonna happen. <laughs> no. Remember when I was in eighth grade? I know, right? Remember the days when I was in eighth grade? So glad those days are over. No, sorry, Clappy. <laughs> no, but once you're uh, you're like our age and stuff, you'll look back on it and you'll be like, oh man, I'm glad we went through middle school. Glad that's over. Glad that's over. Same with college. I'm like, oh, did college? I'm glad that's over. <laughs> It was good experience, I'm good now. Don't need no more college experience. No, but I was thinking about it, escapees. Maybe I should go back to school. Maybe become a psychologist instead. Teaching's okay and stuff, but it's not like, you know, it's not my passion. Can't, you know, lie and say, oh yeah, teaching's my passion. Cause you know, it's not, it's not my passion. You guys, I went to school originally for web design and graphic design. And, uh, you know, I live in the rural part of the state. I don't live in the Seattle part. So I wasn't able to find any cool technology jobs around here. Except for the super high-tech ones. Um, that wanted you to know a lot about, like, coding and CIS and all that stuff. I'm like, oh, jeez. Alright, let's get this guy single out. He doesn't have all the help from the skeletons back there. Woo! Now that's a dancer if I've ever seen one. Oh, oh gosh, we'll have died too. I have to be careful because those souls are precious. There's about 10,000 over there somewhere. <laughs> the fire buddies! Oh no. Yeah, you just in single is single for sure. I was gonna say single is F. Should whack the wormies with the fire stabby. Ooh. I don't think I have the fire stabby. I don't I have some fire bombs. I finally found or I finally bought a torch though. Yay. Clappy says to be honest, I'd rather break an arm or leg so I don't have to go uh so I don't have to do any of the PT, like physical therapy. Um I know I have to do that because the class is full. Oh gosh, of complete knuckleheads apart from the three other leaders. Oh man. Sorry about that clap. No, honestly, I hate it. I don't know about PT. Cause I'm thinking that's physical therapy. That's what we call PT over here. Um if you're talking about PE, physical education class, oh god, I hated that. I was uh, an overweight kid. 
and uh, nobody ever wanted to be my partner, you guys. Well, besides my best friend who was also overweight. But when she wasn't there, oh man, you guys, nobody wanted to be my partner. Sad days for Soul Escape. See, these guys have some fire stabbies on them. Let those guys do their death dive. Oh, come on. He wasn't blocking that side. Okay, good enough. <laughs> good enough. So I just got to go back to my friends and find my souls that I lost. Now, remember this guy back here. He's hiding. Yeah. I got to be careful not to roll off myself, though. That would be bad. Okay, cool. Mm, I think there's a couple of people that jump off over here. And I saw somebody jump off through the back with their shadow. One of those little guys. Oh, come on. I thought, I thought since we knocked him off, he would die. But no, he didn't die. Okay. Now, one of these guys fell, right? Maybe it's just that guy right there. There's another one, though, with him, I know. Okay. Oh, there he is. Oh, hello. Last time you turned me out last time. Okay. Oh, I hate these people with the crossbow so bad. They are the bane of my existence every single time. Ooh, what's PYT? <laughs> Maybe I don't want to know, huh, Bay? Uh-oh. Maybe I don't want to know. It's going to be one of the two. Oh, gosh. Guys, let's throw some Solus Gs, by the way, since I see Kami Star in here. Let's throw some Solus Gs I just remembered. For our escapees in the channel, and we got a new follower also. Thank you guys, thank you for coming in. I hope you had a good Wednesday. Hope you're having a good Thursday as well. I know it just started though. A bit early, I guess, huh? Or late, depending on where you're at. Oh, I thought I dodged that roll. Trying to roll to the left a little bit, but I don't think it let me. <laughs> Thank you guys. Beautiful. That is beautiful. I'm <laughs> playing you tight. What does that mean? <laughs> now I don't know, man. You guys with your cool new school lingo and stuff. Playing you tight. And I didn't know that, Clappy. You go to a mil military school? That's actually pretty cool. I had a couple of friends in college who were doing those rotary classes, which I thought was pretty interesting. They had to wear their uniforms and stuff. That was very, very cool. All right, um, let's see here. So I'm looking for that lady that, I feel like I got a weird splinter, but these don't have splinters on them. I'm looking for that strange lady. I was casting spells. And we'll find her, don't worry. She's, yeah, is she over here? I think so. Main, oh, no, 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 that wasn't the area. I remember, because I remember seeing that guy, and I was like, no, we can't go that way. Okay, there they are, there's my souls. Whew. All right. It wasn't a fair fight, escapees. She knocked us over the edge, that's not fair. <laughs> no, it is, it is, it counts. It counts! It does count. Okay, we can't take her out ourselves. Maybe one by one. We'll go for the her underlings first. Oh, I can't use my Estus. Ah, well, that's what that does. Can't use my Estus. Can I use my healing stuff? Oh, I can still heal the old-fashioned way, though. Weren't thinking about that, were you? Alright, now we can heal up too, just in case. Alright, actually, if you want to fight down here, I'm down. Oh, gosh! I thought she was kind of far up the stairs. Apparently not. Oh, jeez! That happened last time, too, except for she knocked us off the edge. Entirely. Okay, 
Good, got her. Did a couple of heavy attacks there. Okay, let's see if she finally drops that hat. Oh, this guy got... He caught wind of us. I'm gonna try to get to the other side. Attack his unprotected side over there. Drop that giant halberd. <laughs> He's like, no. Okay, this lady was protecting an item, though, so let's go check that out. I know she's got one for us. All right, escapees. I'm pretty sure the headset's probably a little bit wonky by now. I like to fix it every now and then, so let me uh, go ahead and detach it for a second here. I'm going to go... Oh, hey, hob... Hobo Generalist, welcome to the channel. PYT equals pretty young thing. Oh, I didn't know that. I thought uh, <laughs> I thought Blue was telling me the truth. If you're not satisfied with your job, says CM Gary, you should really go to school again while you're still young. For 30 plus, you get kind of lazy. Man, I'm already, oh gosh, I'm already hitting that age, Gary. I'm lazy already. Oh, it's from a Michael Jackson song. Oh, I didn't know that. Unison, there's plenty of websites, dating sites, if you're uh, looking for a girlfriend and stuff. Feel free to hit up those dating sites, my friend. I'm pretty sure somebody wants to kiss you there. Trust me. You'll find a lot of ladies on those dating sites. But yeah, no, I agree with you, Gary. I agree for sure. <laughs> Mine means something else. Oh, well, yeah, I can imagine, Blue. I can imagine. Undead hunter charm. That's what they were hiding over here. Okay, let's go check the other area. So we took out the other guy that was... Um, guarding that side, so we'll see what he was guarding. Let's see what he was guarding. Oh, geez. Gosh dang it. You two again. You two again. Okay, they're dead. I forgot about these guys. Dang it. Hey, at least they dropped something. <gasps> A thrall hood. Ew, they dropped one of their own hoods. Nasty, I bet it stinks. Them. Ugh. Ugh, gross. Okay, this is the other side of the area. Jeez. Well, surprise on that. Was expecting neither of those. Oh, come on, you jerks. Uncalled for. Oh, how many of those Estus? Oh, ding. Did I drink too many of those? I'm gonna drink my whole Estus collection there. Alright, we got rid of one. Get rid of the others too. Ah, oh, jerks, jerks, jerks. Oh, I always attack right at the wrong moment. Okay, there we go. Woo! I think we need to get to 18,000 souls before we can level up, so we're not there yet. But we're getting there. I believe we're level 54 still. No, we're 55 now. Level 55. Beware of ambush, well it's a little bit, oh jeez. I was gonna say it's a little bit too late for that, but no, you're right, there's still an ambush coming. Secondary ambush, I guess. All right, what's this? Oh, soul of a name, nameless, excuse me, nameless soldier. Those ones usually have about 2,000 souls in them. Mm, yeah, let's Estus up just in case. Oh, I still had a regular one. Darn it. I should have healed the old fashioned way. It's okay though. Uh oh. What is that, I wonder? There's some kind of weird fungus at you. Oh, it's that stuff where you can't heal. That would suck if any bosses throw that Estus shard stuff at you. Or stuff where you can't drink your Estus. Oh. All right, Deuce. Deuce is going on that PRB. Thank you for being in here, Deuce. Thank you for the lurkage. And the host. And the host, by the way. Okay, nothing up there so far. Or at least it didn't look like there's anything up there. Let's check this area over here. There's an enemy. There's probably more enemies. I don't know. I don't like how that center is. It's way open. Just very, very open. Oh jeez. Oh, no, 
another dude. Ooh, Grave Warden robe. Cool. All right. Ooh, went at it. Same time. Darn. Ooh, got lucky. All right, here comes two dudes. Oops, run into the flame with them. The soul, you're supposed to stay out of the flame. Okay, I think we have enough to level up, my friends, but let's continue forward because I haven't seen this little last area up there. Oops. One drill sergeant, oh man, for each platoon, and there's three platoons. Clappy says, so I got one from the army, one from the navy, and the other from the marines. Dang, those are your three leaders, huh, you were talking about. The other two were in the army and the marines. Drill sergeant, my word. The marines don't want about PT. Oh, Mr. Gonzo knows. Mr. Gonzo says, damn. Home life must suck if you're in the 8th grade, I already want to be a Marine. I've <laughs> never heard of it! Oh my gosh, Mr. Gonzo. Hey, some people, they have military families. They like it, maybe. Vader said Marines is the most physical if you want to end up doing something a bit more chill, be in the Army or the Navy. Dang, physical activity hype. You get to be all built if you're a Marine. Built indeed. And I hope you're having a good evening too, Yujisen. I hope you are. Uh oh, what does this say? Be wary of left. Oh, left, duh. I was like, left, there's nothing on to the left. All right. All right, so we're coming open, or we're coming across a another big door. I don't know. Uh oh, and this big door has some sounds coming behind it. Is it? No, maybe I just imagined those. Could have sworn I heard something weird. All right, who are these guys praying to? Oh, hold on, let me touch the tablet real quick. Woo, knocked me off my guard. Thank you, new follower. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, oops, I was defending the wrong way. Yeah, it is. Nice little shield up, so I couldn't get him. Ooh, an ember. Cool. Got an ember from the dead guy. All right, this is our second big door that we've run into so far. Should we open it? Let's open this big door. We'll see how it goes. Or what it goes, I guess. Um, I have... Oh, two Estus flasks. Nice. I guess I got two Estus left. And... About it, escapees. 12.04, I have to get off cast pretty soon, my friends. We'll just see what's what over here. Let's see what's what. Uh-oh. I don't know if I want to go through here. Let's do it. I'm curious. I want to... Oh, look at that. It seems we found the next area of our big boss. Cool, you guys. Oh. So if we stream Dark Souls tomorrow, I guess you know what we'll be doing. Going after some boss hypage. Today's cast was more about kind of getting to this area. Or to an area that looks like this, I guess. There we go. Gross! That's like a pile of dead bodies or something. Nasty.
<laughs> Please don't pop out at us, big enemies. A dual charm. The priest. Darn it. Well, there you go. <laughs> well, there you go, Sol. You missed. Oh, oh, he got me. Priest got moves of his own, huh? Uh-oh. Alright, alright, scooch over, soul. There's more than one. Rule number one of Dark Souls. There's always more than one. And it was your fault for not knowing. Oh, a deacon robe. Cool. Drop the clothes for us. Okay, I don't want to get too close to the boss because you know what happens. It'll start up. The entire fight will start. Come on, come on. We need a bonfire here. Try ranged battle. Try ranged battle. Could, but I don't want to fight ranged. I can't. I don't have that many arrows or bolts or anything. Okay, I'm gonna. Oh man. Let's ride the elevator down and we'll see what happens. Fingers crossed, you guys. Fingers crossed. Bye, Clappy. Thank you for everything. Have a good rest of your night, Claps. I hope you do enjoy school tomorrow, though. I'm sorry that it's not going so well. All right, no, let's get back up. All right, Escapees, I do have to go pretty soon. I wish we could fight this boss, but we're actually going to take off. We'll go back to our old bonfire and we'll see the games and stuff. Made it up a couple of levels. I can't remember uh, what level we started the game at. But it's a lot less than what we're at right now. Come on. Let's go. I think I don't think it was downstairs, was it? It was just straight across hall. Maybe. I'm a little bit lost here. That's okay. We can make it on through. <laughs> Gotta love that breathing too, huh? Plus, I'm curious to see what the other door happens to open up to. Does it open up to the actual bottom area where we fight him? Or, you know, who knows? I don't know. We'll go see, though. We could use the bone, but you know what? I don't think... I think we cleared out the path, so I don't think there's... Well, there shouldn't be too many enemies left um, on the original pathway. So we should be good to go, but you never know. Should and will are two different things. <laughs> Jump, soul! No, blue, certain death, man. Blue just wants to see us die. But yeah, just jump. You'll, you'll make it, soul. You'll make it. Go back down the elevator. Was there another bonfire down there? Ah, oh, that's okay. We'll go back to our old bonfire. We'll find that one tomorrow, hopefully. But uh, yeah, thank you for all your tips, you guys. Thank you for the help. I appreciate it. Ooh, that bottom was glitched out for a second. Hey. This guy's still alive. Not fair. Alright. I'll count that as a death. Possibly. Apparently. Oops. Gaining souls rich. Oh, jeez. Come on, man. Shot in the butt. Are you serious? What do you say this? Yeah, apparently gaining souls or something. I heard that it was certain enemies uh, that you kill recharges your flask. I'm like, what? But it could be gaining souls, you know? I, I don't know. I don't know the direct correlation between that. Okay, let's see if this door opens. Does it? Oh, it doesn't open. Okay, so we had to go to that other door. All right. I did kind of want to check out to see what door that was. Okay, let's continue forward, my friends. And the last one that we were at, I think if we go this way, we'll find it. We gotta go here and then down through that elevator, or not elevator, that uh, staircase or whatnot. I think. Oh, no, 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 it's not what I wanted to do. Switch action, there we are. No, switch action kitchen again. There we go, descend. Oh, 
Oh snap! <laughs> that guy appeared out of nowhere. Moth bear. To get my lovely fire stick out too now. My fire stick. Don't worry, this way does lead back, but I think it might have been the long way. Oops. Oops. I'm still new to the area, you guys. I'm sorry. This is my first Dark Souls game ever, by the way. By the by. Okay. Do I have enough items, you guys? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, you guys. Oh, thank you for the follow. Yay! Now, what do you think, Keeper of Stars? That was a pr I'm thinking that's a pretty obvious question, my friend. Kappa, Kappa. Oh, is that? Dang it, Blue, I missed you up there. Good night, Blue. Go, Blue LA. Amazing person. Thank you, Blue, for everything. Hopefully, you have a great rest of your night, and hopefully, we see you tomorrow on the next full stream. Ever onward, ever forward, Blue. Thank you for doing all that you do in the cast and modding and all that stuff, hosting. Without you, the cast would not be where it's at today, Blue. Thank you. Both Blues, actually. I think I have to go back that way, right? Maybe. I think no, we can go back this way. Pretty sure. No wait, didn't I come from this way? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe so. You went one direction. Okay, that's where the ice race is. And then we wrap around back this direction, right? Oh okay, no no no, I see what happened. Alright, yes, 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 yes. That's what we have to do. I have to find that uh, overhang or that overledge and just roll off of it and we'll be back to the right area. Lickety split escapees. There it is. I think it's this ledge. <laughs> roll off, dies. Oh. oh no, this is the wrong ledge. Dang it. No, it was definitely not the ledge. Alright, you know what? I am thoroughly lost. I am indeed. I am thoroughly lost. Let's go back up. Back up the ladder. Back up. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Keeper. I appreciate it. Thank you for the compliment. Love the color. You're in for a treat of a game? Oh, man. Uh, Hobo, I didn't think I would... Uh, I play a lot of Bethesda games, which are way, way easier. And uh, I didn't think I would like this game at all, to be honest. I was like, oh, I've had it since Black Friday of last year, of 2016. And I played it, like, once after I bought it. And I was like, oh, I don't know, man. This game kind of hard. I did get past the first, uh, the trial boss. I don't think I beat the actual first boss, my first character. Trial boss, yes. First boss, no. But, uh, no, but now that I played it, oh man, you guys, I am so glad that we started playing Dark Souls. It's, uh, it's been, I don't know, it's quickly becoming one of my favorite games now. And, uh, well, one of the most addicting, that's for sure. One of the most addicting games that I've ever played. And one of the most difficult. But I've, I've always been kind of a crazy person. I like the challenge and whatnot. Alright, we have to go through all these people, I will, but... I'd rather, you know, not. I'd rather not and say we did. So I'm just heading back to the most recent bonfire that I found. There might have been one down that uh, ladder, but I haven't found it just yet, you guys, and I don't want to, you know, risk going into some crazy enemies and dying. I'd rather fight these somewhat weaker enemies. No, they're all like, weaker? How dare you? But yay, we made it safely back. We can go ahead and level up, too, before we take off. But uh, thank you for hanging out tonight, Escapees. I do appreciate it. You guys are awesome. If you're not uh, following the Soul Stream yet, please consider hitting the follow button. We do stream a variety of games. We have Bethesda games. We got Fallout 4. We have uh, Skyrim. We got Oblivion. We have Fallout 3. We have well, Dark Souls that we've been streaming. A couple other games that we're gonna jump on. I hope too. McClown, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. Sorry that we're you know taking off pretty soon. How do you? So you like it, huh, Hobo? It's a masterpiece says yeah no spoilers no spoilers please you guys but uh yeah we're kind i'm kind of iffy with the help you know if i do need help on certain things i do ask but 
usually I'm kind of like, oh, it's okay, you know, try to get less help. Remy, thank you for everything. Welcome to the channel. And uh, yeah, good night. Thank you for hanging out, you guys. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you, Keeper. Keeper of stars. Well, I love your name, to be honest. Anything to do with stars is always A-OK -okay in my books. Yeah, Battlefield 1, Mr. Gonzo. Oh, man, I'm going to suck at that game, Mr. G. Not that I don't, you know, not that I'm not terrible at Dark Souls, but I'm going to be awful at that one. Hopefully, one of these days, yeah, I'll jump on that battlefield. I need to check it out off stream to see if I can even play it. I like to play the story modes of games, uh, like we did with Gears of War 4, when we played through that story mode. That's another game that I got during that Black Friday special last year. Hopefully this year we have some good Black Friday titles too. Good night, Vajra. Thank you for everything. I'm just going to level up Escapees to hopefully level 56, I think. And then uh, we'll be able to take off for the rest of the night. Go pass out. Go pass out. Welcome home, Ashen One. Last night I stayed streaming until 1, but I don't want to do that today because i got to get up at about 5, so I'm like, oh gosh, I'm tired. I pushed it till six, but man, my shower was short and I had to dry my hair fast. I had to straighten my hair, put on makeup, put clothes on and just take off in the morning. It was uh, it was pretty hectic, Very but well. it's doable. Then it touch the dark doable. Good night, Vajra. Thank you for everything. Uh, much love, Bay, And hopefully we'll keep that streak going on the Snapchat. She's the person that I have the longest streak with, you guys. And I'm slowly losing my streaks with everybody else, but hey, me and Vajra are going strong. Indeed. All right. So I've been working on, this is my first character, so she's kind of like a catch-all character. I've been working on her vigor a little bit, but mostly vitality and strength. Dexterity too, because I'm going to need to wield a different type of weapon eventually, you guys. Can't stay with my regular weapons forever. Strength is, though, is uh, one of my favorites, though. Vitality too. Strength and vitality are my favorites. Endurance has, you know, it's good qualities also. True that. Got to get more stamina going. Um, let's go with, I know I am a herald, so I should be working on faith at least a little bit. But let's go with, last time we went with strength. We'll go with one more dexterity. Some of those weapons uh, require you to have like a 30 dexterity. I'm like, oh gosh, okay. All right, let's go ahead and level up. We'll call it good. Guys, can we get a level 57 hype in the channel? We did it. Exclamation hype, level 57. We hit a couple of milestones in this stream today, you guys. We made it to 2,000, or excuse me, 7,200 followers. Excellent, you guys. Oh, okay, thank you, Bay. I'll try to snap you too. Right before bed, ooh. Kappa, kappa. <laughs> right, Keeper, oh gosh. Good old PH and sleep, man. PH and sleep. Don't lie like you're not gonna do it now. No. We all know. Deuce, thank you for everything. Bye, Deuce. Have a good night. Ever onward, ever forward, you guys. To bed, to sleep. And uh, I do want to say something real quick, you guys. Thank you for hanging out with me, Escapees. Uh, without you guys in the channel, the stream wouldn't be, you know, where it's at today. The stream wouldn't even be here. So I appreciate it, you guys, having just, you know, at least one or two people coming in. If that's all we get, that's fine. I'm just glad to have the company and somebody to talk to you guys. So thank you for that. You guys make it awesome make it worth the cast, so I appreciate it. Throw some soul gems in the channel. We threw a lot of soul gems when we hit that 7,200 uh, follower. We hit, threw down 200 for that one. Let's see, let's check the numbers. People could unfollow though, so it does happen. 7,209, thank you guys. Yes, we made it, we made that goal. Drop some soulless Gs for our ascendants. Ascendants are just the subscribers in the stream. They get the cool soulless G emote. Little G has been with us in the channel since it started so um, she didn't really make too much too many appearances in the first couple of months of the stream it was only until afterwards where I decided that I didn't want my Green Day poster showing every single time so I was like you know what let's get little G in here I sleep with little G oh a cap of pride no, I do sleep with her so she's got some little fuzziness going on little dog hairs going on that I don't like no, we're not going to make out, you guys. Psh, don't even ask. No, I'm just kidding. Everybody's like, whoa, so what are you talking about? But yeah, that's, the, that's little G. She was a uh, college project, fine arts project. It was, uh, the prompt was, um, the prompt was weird. It was like, yourself, express yourself in 3D form or make yourself in 3D form and not 3D computer uh, graphics or anything. 
uh, 3D form, as in you could sculpt yourself, you could draw yourself, um, or mold yourself with paper mache, you know, whatever you wanted to do. I ended up making a pillow version of myself. I used to have a blonde streak right in the middle of my bangs and stuff. The rest of my hair was black. But uh, I never wore a hat. I just kind of went Legend of Zelda style. But uh, anyways, you guys, enough about that. Enough about the history of Lil G. We need to get out of here, my friends. I gotta go to sleep. I know you guys have uh, other things to do as well. So we shall go ahead and save that game. I bet we still look like a zombie too. Made to level 57 though. We started at level 54 or so. Three levels hype, not bad. And we made it to our next boss. Beat the Crystal Sage yesterday and we finally found the next boss. I don't know who he is, but we'll probably meet him tomorrow if we're playing some Dark Souls. Oh man, escapees. <laughs> you go both ways, says Blue. Psh, one way only. I'll let you know which, or I'll let you uh, guess which one that is. <laughs> Little G's bigger than I expected. Yeah, she's pretty big. She is. The uh, Oh yeah, the rest of the prompt was it had to be two feet or bigger. So it did have to be a pretty big um, Little G and whatnot. Yeah, she's life size. So she's at least two feet, two feet tall. I drew her out on grid paper first. And then I, with the ruler, I drew out all of the... Um, dimensions and stuff and I just cut it out of the felt and stuffed her in with some cotton. I thought I was gonna get in trouble because Lil G has no back. Completely blank because I was, this is all hand sewn, Lil G's hand sewn. So it took me hours you guys, a lot longer than I thought it would. And uh, you know, I thought I was gonna get a bad grade but no, I aced it. She was like, my professor at the time, she's like, oh my god, that's amazing. She goes, no, no, no. Cause I go, I'm sorry, you know, I didn't have a chance to finish the back, so I kind of just sewed it all together real fast. She goes, no, that's amazing. Uh, just whatever you did in the front, that's more than enough. I see that you hand sewed it. She's like, man, that took a lot of time and effort. I think it's because she was uh, grading a whole bunch of people that just drew themselves and stuff, which is fine, but um, we weren't drawing majors, so we were kind of like chicken scratch drawing ourselves. <laughs> and uh, yep, so she was like, oh no, that's good. That's definitely, yep, you aced that. I was like, cool. That. Going for food, nice Tommy. Have some good food. Share. No, I would say share, but I'm going to bed, so I probably shouldn't eat, huh? Alright, my friends, let me go ahead and I'm gonna open a new tab here. Just to see if anybody I know is streaming, because Doc Savage might still be on. He usually gets on at about midnight. 3 a.m. where he's at. Alright, no, nobody else on you guys. We've got soda popping. He's in Japan right now. I've been watching a lot of his uh, castage lately. All right, escape piece, so we'll just have to cut off the channel. Thank you, Blue. Guys, if you are enjoying the stream, thank you for, you know, hanging out and stuff. If you want to hit the follow button, that would be much appreciated. Smack that follow button, but only use your hands. I'm tired of using Clorox wipes on it. Um, thank you for the follow, by the way. And yes, if you want to follow us on Instagram, Twitter, any of that social media stuff, it is soul underscore escape, capital S-E-U-L underscore 3-S-C-4-P-3. If you want to follow the Snapchat, it's right on the back of that, soul hour escape, S-A-U-L zero U-R 3-S-C-A-P-E. Switch that up a little bit so I could add some people from off the cast without them knowing about the cast. Soul space escape if you want our Xbox gamer tag or access to our club. Capital S U L space 3 S C 4 P 3. The only difference with that is the space right there. We are at 7,000 followers right now. Thank you, escapees. We've been streaming for two and a half years. And uh, it's been quite a ride, you guys. Very, very enjoyable. Wouldn't change it for the world. Thank you for everything, you guys. Without you, the stream would not be possible. So I do appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Have a great rest of your night. Real quick, these are the list of the commands. I like to show them beginning of the cast and might as well show them at the end. Public use, anybody can use those. And as always, the stream is ending, you guys. Thank you for kicking it. Bible thump. Bye, CM Gary. Have a good night. Too many hosters, indeed. Too many hosters. Bye, Torchwood. Thank you for hanging out. Lurkers, have a great night. You guys are the backbones of the community. Not just mine, but any and every Twitch community. The lurkers are the backbone. I'm gonna check my viewer list. I like watching it. I haven't really uh, seen my viewer list too often. It's good to know who's in the stream. Sometimes a lot of people are watching from outside of Twitch. Yeah. Viewer list, but they are viewing. 
Alright, escapees. I'm gonna get on over to the dashboard. We'll do a quick shout out to our hosters tonight. We have 43 hosters. Nice. Thank you guys. Metal Dude Phil, thank you for the host. And Tropic J, R942485, Void Chi, Nimrod5885, McClown, a new hoster. AK47 Knight, Green Leader87, Du Stanley, Midnight Bang X, Beja, KSA Fusion King, Irish Trekkie85, Moab de Jedi, Shady Days, JBear12, Sparky Thread, Hypnotic Chronic One, the Bay Hypnotic Chronic One still has on his uh, auto photo, auto, auto photo list, auto follow list, or auto uh, hosting list, excuse me. Uh, Void Chi, Mojo Jojo 19 Kilo, Knife Party Hard, The Chod Father, Smokestack 45, Commander Cephalo, and Mitchell P, Clappy 68, LV Token, The Light Wolf Peter, Watery Rabbit, Dark Lurky, Wretched Dreams, Kids the Master, Evil Lip Smacker, Dose Lionheart 111, uh, Go Blue LA 99, Spike 752, and it refreshed. Oh, Phenom Gaming. Bessie Gaming, Iron Ryan 1020, Sparky Thread, and I believe that's, oh, Nitro Fusion 101, Deuce Stanley, Buddha Man X, and I believe that's it, Escapees. The list refreshes and whatnot. Oh, Moabdiv Jedi, Steel Goodwin, I see you there, Steel. And if I missed you, I am sorry, Escapees. This dang thing does refresh. If I said your name twice, I'm sorry, too. <laughs> like, damn it, well. Stop that. All right, my friends. I appreciate it. Thank you for the hosts. Feel free to check out any of those people. I know I said their names a little bit fast. Sometimes if we just have the hoster command, it's a lot easier, but it has too many characters, too many names to be able to post it, unfortunately. All right, escapees, one last round of gems for sticking it out this long. And I will bid you adieu. Have a good night, my friends. Have an awesome Thursday. Getting closer to that Friday hype, getting closer to that weekend hype escapees. We might be back tomorrow with some Dark Souls. I might change up the game. It's just a surprise. You never know. Just like the schedule. It's always a surprise. No. All right, escapees. Thank you for everything. And as always, ever onward, ever forward, I will catch you at the next Soul Streamer.